and we are live. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, welcome back to what lies beyond existence. I am Nick Holden the second, and we're back for Final Fantasy IX. Yes! So, first of all, an amazing good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are in the world. And, if you're on YouTube, whenever you are in time. Yeah. So, how have you been since yesterday? Hopefully, amazingly well. I did. Now, now I am so ecstatic to finally be able to go back to a game that means so damn much to me. Yeah, so, Final Fantasy IX, we started yesterday. Final Fantasy IX was... I, I, can, I can disclose it right now. Was the reason... Um, for for me to deciding on doing a not a full on Final Fantasy franchise run, but uh, a solid one throughout the their most amazing and iconic games. So from six on forward, we're gonna play all the numbered ones. We're probably gonna skip X two, so ten two and thirteen two and three. However, all of that was just an excuse for me to play. Final Fantasy IX. That was my favorite. That's my favorite Final Fantasy game. And it's probably within my top three favorite games ever. Yeah. Oh no. Did I? Eh. Ah, okay. It's. Completely forgot to put a new uh, title on, on today's stream. Well, it works fine today. For today. But uh, yeah. This, this game. This game is so good. So, a uh, quick recap, recap of what happened yesterday. Uh, we started the game. We started as the main character, Zidane. Uh, and he works for this troop, uh, Tantalus. And Tantalus was, uh, went to Alexandria to perform a new, a, a new play. But the main goal behind it was to kidnap Princess Garnet, daughter of uh, the Queen Bran from Alexandria. However, what the main character didn't know was that Princess Garnet wanted to be kidnapped. So, well, win-win. Eventually, everything went more or less okay-ish with what they want. Princess Garnet uh, was able to leave Alexandria with Zidane, followed very closely by her by the, the, the captain of Knights of Pluto, Mr. Adabel Adalbert Steiner, and the new friend they got, Vivi. Um, eventually they were able to pass on through the ice cave, and we're now on the on the, the, the little village of Dali. Um, Vivi was kidnapped, and we're on the process of finding out what happened and why was he kidnapped. So, with that said, we can just whoop, jump back onto. Sorry, we can finally be able to jump on to here, and yeah, we're gonna go play. If my controller works, it works. Okay, let's just continue. Yes, so we're here. We have Vivi, Zidane, and Dagger. They're not at full health, at least not Zidane and Vivi. Mm. I could probably use a cure on Zidane. And, yeah, we'll keep on going. We found... we already found Vivi. We were able to... to... to free him from a weird coffin-like structure. He was here. Uh, uh, and now we're gonna go and keep on following with with the, the main story. Weird contraptions here. Here's another strange machine. It looks kind of like the mist engine on the theater ship. Yeah. Yeah. Weird machines. I can almost see inside. But I can't see anyone, anything. I just hear some noises. Are the eggs etching? Mm. 
Ah, uh, what is this? There, some parts are different, but they look like Vivi. They're like the the. They look like the the black Waltz, the one that we face already. Number one. Hey, Zeno Saga, or you, Zeno? What's up? Uh, I missed some of the game. By the way, this is my favorite PS1 Final Fantasy. Dude, this is my favorite Final Fantasy. Period. Bar none. It's probably... If it's not my favorite game, it's definitely top three. Right now, I can basically say it's my favorite Final Fantasy. And, yeah, so we have that in common. Yeah, you missed yesterday. However, we're still in Dali. We're basically in the beginning. But, yeah, good for you. Uh, actually, no. It's good for me that you're here. Thank you so much. Such an amazing game, man. Such an amazing game. I really love this game. What is this? Are they dolls? Someone's coming. Vivi, dagger. Why? Is my mother behind this? This is the only way. Hide. What are you doing, Zidane? <laughs> Sorry, but stay quiet. Hey, did you say something? Lots of kids, no grown up. Nope, not me. Okay, never mind. It's almost time. Hurry it up, will ya? I hear ya. All the workers, they're all kids. Zidane. Ah, uh, Vivi. So they're all in coffins now. And poor little Stainer. Always lost. Pardon me. I must escort a person of high rank to the castle. When will the cargo ship arrive? I'm busy. You're in my way. You're in my way. Are you gonna say jet? Yeah. Kill on is it's only good. Hmm, looks good. I need to get out of his way. He clearly does not want to be disturbed. One hundred and thirty-five gil. That's good. And the night potion. Let's look at the card here. Nothing there. Let's go check out the dude now. That is that's it. That is at his home. The smell of coffee. Blah, blah. Sorry, it's it's Thursday. You guys know that at the end of the week, my English just goes. It's never, my English is never, never really good, but by the end of the week, it just becomes <laughs> a complete mess. Oh, what a cup. Oh, thank you. I'm not here to drink coffee. Tell me when the cargo ship will arrive, or else the Alexandrian royal family will appropriate this property. <laughs> and then what? Hey, Roro! Hello! Good morning! Bonjour! <laughs> How are you, man? I'm fine. I'm awesome. I'm back in my game, so <laughs> I'm awesome. And you, man. How are you? I order you to tell me when the cargo ship will arrive. Tell me! You're not a very creative interrogator. Yeah. I'm just trying to do what is right. Perfect. Awesome. Good to have you here again. Thank you so much. Zeno says, for now I decided to just download all my hard copies and a few digital games on my Switch's hard drive. Most of my digital games aren't on it, but I got the one I've been playing the most. I noticed that you were playing uh, Tales of Arise the other day. Awesome, I've, I've completed that game uh, not that long ago. I loved it. How are you... How are you liking it? And by the way, tell me, how... how how is your thing? Did did you find a way to to make your uh, Ethernet connection better? Uh, how did how did it all uh, worked out for you? So who decides right or wrong? You? Anyone can tell right from wrong. Ah, still as green as a pickle. When will the cargo ship arrive? It is not gonna tell you. It's already here. They should be loading it now. Why couldn't you tell me sooner? Thank you. <laughs> well, 
But since we're here, let's play some cards. Let's see if we can lose some of our own cards. I got one of those. Let's use the, the ones that we don't like. So that we can lose a, li a little bit faster, yeah. Um... Come on. Come on. He has, is physical, I'm magical. Um, I don't know how this will work out. Um, hmm. I'm gonna try this. Ah, come on. So... Apparently, we're going to lose all our cards. We are going to lose all our cards. Well, not all of them. Luckily, have lots of different versions of the same cards. Ooh, uh, that one is good. That one can eat everywhere. Um, how are we going to do this? Maybe here? Eh. That one will change. Mm. Okay. Like this? Nope. Ooh. This is ridiculous. I've I'm I'm How did that happen? Oh, you took away my, my, my favorite one. That one could hit everywhere. No, I'm not gonna play a rematch. This guy is very rude. So, I beat all the bosses on the last few story bits and then the internet cut out. Oh, I will try again on YouTube at some point. But if it does, does it again, I'll just pre-record it and upload. Yeah. Yeah. That sucks, man. That sucks. I loved it. I, I really loved uh, Tales of Arise. It quickly became my favorite one after Tales of Berseria. I still prefer Tales of Berseria. I love I love a character that's not a, a, that's basically an anti an anti hero. And Berseria is a story of vengeance. And now my camera just froze. Uh, give me a second, guys. I'm gonna restart my cam. Gonna restart my camera. I'm still here. You still hear my voice. Now I'm just a voice from the beyond. Yeah. Let's deactivate. Take off. And activate it again. Yes. And here it is. There. Yeah. It works. It worked. It's a very inexpensive camera, so, yeah. Okay. Ha! It is indeed the cargo ship. Now I can take the princess back to the castle. Now I must think of a way to get her on the ship. Hmm. What? There is something coming out of the ground. Hmm. I wonder... I wonder what they're gonna use them for. We've been making lots of them since they set up the factory six, mo six months ago. Who cares? This is a piece of cake compared to farming. Better money, though. Better money, too. Hey, is that scary guy in the armor running towards us? Let's get out of here. That's how you know they're up to no good. When they see someone running and they just... This barrel, what could be inside? What could they possibly be shipping out from this village? What a... Did I just see that barrel move? No. Let's see. Observe it some more. I've seen this pattern somewhere before. Ha! Ah, it's moving. Halt! In the name of the queen. Alright, give it another push. Ah, the barrel spoke. 
Poor Stainer. Poor Stainer. Stainer is... Poor Stainer as, as, as the worst of times. Princess, what in the world is going on? You scoundrel. Is this your doing? Stainer, please. Yes, your highness. Zidane, I don't know what they say to Vivi. I never knew anything suspicious was going on at the castle. We still don't know for sure. Let's stay by Vivi's side. Yeah, that, that, it's something weird. This is not a time to panic. I must get the princess on board the ship somehow. Eh. Then we can head back to Alexandria Castle. Yo, Rusty, do you know where this airship's going? L Lindblom. Yes, to Lindblom. That's convenient. Did you ask someone? The dairy old man in the shack told me. So it must be true. You're acting strange. Something is heading this way. Oh, yeah. My stream of Tales of Arise is my third playthrough and my second time on unknown mode. I streamed it for over nine hours the day before and never had any issues. But for some reason, internet decided to crash after I beat all the final bosses the next day. Yeah, internet can suck sometimes. What do you have? Uh, is is it uh, fiber? Fiber tends to be very stable. Here in, in Portugal, only one... No, actually two companies have fiber. The third one, which is the one that I'm using, has fiber only to, to a box outside. Then we have like this uh, copper cable. So I'm... Yeah. That's not a very... A very good company, but as soon as I got my my cable directly from the router to the PC, I stopped having issues. At least bigger ones. Sometimes it still fluctuates, but I advise every single one, if you guys can, in your own countries. I don't know how it works there. Uh, get line, get a uh, fiber, fiber optics, so good. Okay, Princess Garnet, the queen is waiting for you at the castle. You were all sent by the castle? What? What are you talking about? You were all unconscious from the blizzard. He said he was a Black Waltz. Are you the one who defeated number one? I'm Black Waltz number two. My power, magic and speed make me far superior to number one. Resistance is futile. Come, Princess, the queen awaits. No, I will not return to the castle. Come with me or you'll regret it. Wait, I, Steiner, shall escort the princess back to the castle. Heh <laughs> you think I care? I won't let you stand in the way of my mission. Oof. Okay. Another Black Waltz. This guy's... These guys do not kid around, around. Princess, stay there while I kill the others. So, we basically know that you won't attack Dagger. You want to attack Dagger, which means that we can safely... Stippled hat. Okay. We can safely steal from him. Um... I don't need to. I'm gonna use her to attack. Vivi, focus. You can attack. I want to steal from him first. Everything that I can. So, yeah. Couldn't steal anything. And now focus on... I can still focus. Great. Keep on attack. We have Spectrum. My mom had Spectrum when I was living with her in Alabama. But I'm in Maine now. It only happens here. I never had any issues before. Uh, that's weird. That is weird. There's a streamer though that... That, that, I, that I usually follow. He does not have good things to say about Spectrum, but it's I, I'm just quoting him. I I have no I have no um no no knowledge about what Spectrum is. It's a company, but but I know the name. Couldn't steal anything. Come on, let's cast a Blizzard. I'm attacking. But yeah, if you had any, if you didn't have any issues in Alabama, but you you have one, you have some issues in Maine now. I, it's weird. That is weird. 
Okay. Quick. See there. And Blizzard again. Ooh! No. Phoenix down on him. No! <laughs> Come on. The dude set up a target and... Wait. Cast fire now. Couldn't steal anything. Come on, Zidane. Come on, Zidane. You're killing me. Pyra. Oof. Pyra. Yeah, that won't work. Leather plate. Bam, bam. Keep on using Zidane to steal. I'm gonna keep on using Zidane to steal. I don't know what he ha doesn't have anything. Awesome. So I can now. Keep on doing my stuff. I can now beat him senseless. Or at least I'm gonna try. Might not work. Attack him. This is how you use fire. Is he gonna cast a fire? It's a fire. Random fire. Okay. But this is how you cast a fire sword. Boom. There you go. Protect. Protect is good. Protect is very, very good. Black Waltz number two. Did my mother really send him to capture me? It can't be. There's no reason to trust the words of some bandit. He was just another criminal, scheming to use the princess for some evil deed. Have I not been careful enough? Your noble upbringing cannot be disguised so easily. That's not true at all. You haven't been watching. Dagger is trying really hard. You're the one with the problem, walking around yelling princess everywhere. About the border crossing, yes. Why don't we each ride on this airship? Sure, Lindlum should not be terribly far by, by airship. Yeah. I mean, won't be too far. Yes, that's what I wanted to say too. But why don't we get some rest before we go in? Yes, let's rest at the end. Okay, let's head back to the village. Vivi, you'll be safe with me. Poor Vivi. Poor Vivi. Seriously. Such a sweet dude. Such a sweet dude, but then this. Let's leave it alone. I think the mayor is still inside. Mm. The mayor is still inside. We're gonna rest at the inn. I would love to confront this dude here. He's out cold. He's not out cold. He's pretending. Oh, I'm sorry. E. Hmm. I thought they'd captured it already. Yeah. He's in on it. The dude is in on it. On on the Vivi's kidnapping. Hey, I know she's cute, but it's rude, rude of you to stare. Oh, no, I wasn't staring at the young lady. The, the room is through that door. Yeah. Stay calm. Yeah. Huh. 
is starting to notice there, there's something wrong there. He's starting to notice. You're gonna say anything new? Hey, excuse me, I was just daydreaming. Yeah. Let's check. Read email. Trapped in ice. We read this. We read this yesterday. Let's just save since we're here. Since we're here, let's save. Okay. Yes. Back onto your thing. Cancel. Goodbye. I'm gonna try and figure out a way because I really. I really want to check out some stuff. Because that mayor, I really do not like that guy. But let's check out our equip uh, our equipment. Um antibody, I have nothing to put there. Broadsword and bug killer. Still need them. Um leather shirt. Protect girls, I got it. Ooh, leather plate. Chakra. Cure and Thunder. Yeah, uh, I could get the the status, but there's no ability here. There's no gain in it. Dagger either. Still the leather wrists though. Beast Killer might be okay. Dagger got protect, but I got no alternative to the rod. So stippled hat. Now they appear. But now... Got no use for it. I mean... Could raise the status. Probably give it to Vivi, though. I'll give her a leather wrist. I'll give her uh, a leather wrist. Because it raises the status. Strength. Do I want to raise her strength? That's the thing. Probably not. Probably not. But the magic defense from 6 to 9. That's alright. I'm gonna protect Vivi though. I only have one for now. I'm gonna protect Vivi. It's already have he already has a leather wrist, a mage staff, I don't have any choice. Silk shirt is the best that I can give, so yeah. Uh let's see how are we with abilities. I think we got everything. Yeah. So, they're alright. They're optimized for this. They're not opti optimized because I think the mayor is still inside. They're not optimized because I still have some abilities to learn from older items, but... Stainer, for example. I, have lo I love chocobos. Here, listen carefully. Did you hear that? I did. I did hear that. You, talk to me. I'm sorry, we're not open yet. Wait, what do you sell? Potions... Just one. Just one and four here and three here. Basically because I don't like odd numbers. My OCD doesn't allow it. Um... They're making me go a certain way. I'm gonna need a key to open this up. It says Mayor's key here. Mm. I cannot. I still cannot get the items because this is still working. Huh. I don't, I don't remember. Cannot get to that chest yet. Kids these days. What you have to say? They made those patterns on the ground to, make, to mark an airship landing site. Do you want to get going? No, I want to get back to the village. It's weird. Kid, talk to me. 
We don't have to work the farm because of them. I wonder if he can run and stuff. Uh. Cannot check that out yet. Huh. Do I need to board the ship? Welcome. No. No. Sorry. No. That doesn't tell me anything. I think the mayor is still inside. Choco, choco, choco. Yeah. She won't say a thing. Huh. Let's leave it alone. So I cannot go back. I don't have the mayor's... The mayor's key yet. He doesn't let me in because the thing the mayor is still inside. Do I need to leave? Hey girl, talk to me a little bit. Can come inside. Yeah, I think I need to leave. There's nothing else I can do. Unless I'm missing something, which I don't think I am. I just need to board the ship. That's what I'm gonna do. I could not get back, so board the, sh the airship. Wait here while I ask the people inside if we can hitch a ride. I shall go ask them. Oh, really? How come? It is not for your benefit. I am only doing this for the princess. Steiner. He was so adamant about going back to the castle before. An airship full of barrels like the ones I saw at the castle. Steiner was against going. Zidane, is this ship really headed for Lindblom? No, it'll probably take us straight to Alexandria Castle. <laughs> They're onto him. They're so onto him. But why didn't you say something? Yeah, I know, trust me. Zidane. What is it, Vivi? Those dolls, they were making underground. Do you think they look like me? Maybe a little, but they're just dolls, Vivi. It's moving. What the heck is Stainer up to? Alright, we have to get on, Dagger. On a ship that's not going to Lindblom? I don't have time to explain. This way. Hurry up. Am I really gonna leave two chests behind? You have nothing to worry about. Hurry before she takes off. But I'll take you to Lindblom, I promise. Oh. Fine, I'll get on. It's taking off. Oof. Soft. <laughs> I really do not want that I left some chests behind. Come on, it's not like I did it on purpose. Please, enough. There's that royal tone in your voice again. Are you okay, Vivi? Feels like I'm going to get sucked into the sky. Let's get inside, Vivi. I think I missed something. I trust you, Zidane. I get the feeling she doesn't quite trust me yet. Yeah. Maybe she'll reward me with a kiss or two if I try hard enough. Whoa, already? Zidane. What is it? Something wrong? It's Vivi. Vivi? Hello. Whoa, they're alive. And they're moving around. 
So the mages built in the village bring back the new ones. Oh, Vivi. Vivi. This is such a sad story. Were you able to talk to any of them? Poor Vivi is, is the sweetest. And yet? No. It's like... They don't even see me at all. I tried. Again and again. But... They won't even turn around. Vivi. I need to go upstairs for a little bit. I gotta turn the ship around before it reaches the castle. Oh. Keep an eye on Vivi, okay? This this music, it's so good. This song, this song is so chill. Who is behind all of this? I don't know. I mean, I do know. It looks like a treasure chest, chest but it's actually a part of the ship. Oh. They don't say a thing. We'll be flying over evil, evil forest soon. Did the boss and the others escape safely? <laughs> Sorry. I'm sure the boss would tell me that it's none of my business. Oh. You're not wrong. Your, boy, your boss looks like someone who would do that. Tell you exactly that. How could this happen? What am I to do? I never expected things to go so badly. I cannot believe the ship took off without a princess. What will I say to Queen Bronn? What the heck were you doing? You almost took off without us. That is because the ship's crew. Why you? Where's the princess? In the engine room. She's on the ship? All is well now. This ship is returning to the castle. You will be hanged for the kidnapping of a member of the royal family. Enjoy your freedom while you can. Yeah, that's not gonna happen, dude. Sorry. It's like he doesn't even see me. Yeah, there's a dude. I will not let you near the princess. I don't need your say-so. I love this moment of the game before Lindblom. Yeah. 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 It's 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 all so chill. Everything's so relaxing. The songs, the the, the atmosphere. It, it's such it's such a beautiful game. It's such a well-written game. At last, Queen Bran is sure to be pleased. I'm saying Bran as if it it's German or something, but I have no clue. It sounds like it, but... However, the princess would have been left behind without the thief's aid. I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. But that was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, yes. It is my duty as a knight. W what the... So... After Lindblom is a little less relaxed. Just a tiny bit. Just 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 a little bit less relaxed, yes. I, I tend to agree. <laughs> yeah. As soon as we, we get as soon as we meet another character and we go to her house, our her village, things start to get a little a little less relaxed. I, I agree with you. <laughs> You're totally right. What's wrong? Something stuck in your throat? You, uh, uh, you insolent fool! Turn the ship around! Nope. 
I will have your head for that. Hey, I think we upset them. But they didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. I apologize. Please wait while I take this fool into custody and turn the ship around. Whoa, what's wrong? This is what's wrong. That's what's wrong. Vivi, are you okay? So, number two was defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. Black Waltz, number three. Princess, stay, stay there while I eliminate this child. Are you protecting him? Nonsense. You are no different from mindless dolls. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare to fight a Black Waltz? I said, get out of my way. But the videos look so pretty. What's on the videos is horrible. But the way they look... Oof. Poor Vivi. He's a kid. It said that they were mindless dolls, and it treated them like mindless dolls. This is brutal. What cruelty! Ah. Master Vivi, I shall assist you. Hey, you guys! Dagger. Yes. We'll take care of the Black Waltz. You steer the ship. Things are gonna get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too late to turn back. You can go back to the castle or cross South Gate into Lindemann. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way, but try not to crash the ship. Yeah, that would be good. Anything here to get? No. Be careful, Zidane. I'll be fine. Never even giving a chance to wake up either. Right? It's... Vivi's story, it's... it's so... It's sad. It's a sad story. This game reminds me a lot... Now that I've played 6, it has a lot of things that remind me of 6. With the, with the clowns and, and some of the levity here and there. But it also has, in a very fundamental uh, part of it, the same sadness 6 has. All the stories in 6, or 90% of the stories in 6, are sad stories. And Vivi's story here is basically, it's basically the same, the same, it has basically the same theme. Very sad story. And it's, it, it makes it even worse when you think that Vivi is a kid. I'm a father. This, this is hurting me now more than it did back then. It's, it's, it's very, very, very painful to watch. And now that I'm think that I'm seeing this and I'm remind I'm remembering what's coming next. That's that's gonna be a very tough pill to swallow. Okay. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? You fool. Do I look like some lonely black mage soldier? Even if they weren't your allies, what you did was reprehensible. Worry not about them. Many more are being produced even now. They're being produced. What are you? Ha! The princess's bodyguards have gathered. How very convenient. Answer me. It wouldn't do you any good if I answered, since you're all going to die. I will eliminate any who stand in my way. Yeah, no you won't. You are part of the problem, not the solution. Right now, you are the problem. And Vivi's in trance. Which means... Double fire in your face. 
Lin and Karas. Uh, I'm gonna keep on attacking. Double Black Mage. Hopefully this don't this doesn't kill it because I really need to make sure I really need to make sure that I steal everything from him. I'm dealing a, I'm dealing a good chunk of magic. Stippled hat. Thundera. Oof. Thundera is a number. Let's potion on Stainer. Couldn't steal anything, so it still has something. Probably the, the rare drop. It, it still has probably the rare drop. And Vivi lost it. Had no choice. Tundra. Tundra, Tundra did some damage. I'm gonna keep on killing Stainer. Adelbert Stainer. We don't steal anything. Come on, Zidane. You're killing me. You're killing me, Zidane. And the potion on Vivi. Couldn't steal anything. Come on, Zidane. I want that red drop. I don't know what it is, but now that I know that you have it, I want it. Pyra. Potion on Vivi. Come on, Zidane. Come on. Come on, show it. Couldn't steal anything, come on! And, and, and Zidane went to the front, yes! And now Stainer's in trance, great! Couldn't steal anything, ah! Boom! Not, not, couldn't steal anything is totally different. You get one portion. Couldn't steal anything. Come on, Zidane. I really hope that whatever the hell he has is amazing. I'm really counting on it. I'm really counting on it. Oof. Come on. Still anything, seriously. I could have killed this guy twice now. Let's cast a potion on him. I'm a master thief, but I can steal a rare item most of the time. Final Fantasy IX in a nutshell. Yeah. Yeah. That rare drop, man. I don't remember what it is. I really don't remember what it is. But I really do not... Couldn't steal anything. Seriously. It might be... I don't think I don't know. Is it a staff for VV? I don't remember. 
I don't actually remember. Couldn't steal. Seriously, Zidane. And by now, I could have killed it twice. Or three times now. Couldn't steal. Awesome. This is taking so long that the, the boss probably... The boss probably already wasted all its MP. He did everything he could. And now he just doesn't have any MP. Oh no, he's a blizzard. Here's a blizzard to prove me wrong. Couldn't steal. Seriously. Defend. And another blizzard. 63. That's still a number. Eh, defend. Defend. Zidane. Yes, Roro. Yes. For the love of Bahamut. You're killing me, Zidane. Because he does have a, a, another item in there, but he's not getting it. I wonder... I wonder what's the... The percentage. Ooh, that was a big hit. I wonder what the percentage of, of the drop is. Couldn't steal. This, this is less than 25% for sure. It's less than 25% chance of getting the item. Definitely. I can be here forever, but... Couldn't steal. Seriously. Oh. It must be one hell of a weapon. It truly really must be a one hell of a weapon. Seriously. Hit him. Boop. It's seven. This is brutal. This is brutal. <laughs> Come on. Thundera. Thing is, while I'm doing this, he's just casting second level magic on our faces over and over again. Steiner. Do you know what weapon the, the mage has? No. No clue. I have no clue. I don't even know if it's a weapon. It might be a, a piece of equipment. But it, it is a rare drop. I don't remember. I don't actually remember what it is. I don't actually remember what it is. But it's definitely a rare drop. Because if he didn't have anything, on the, on the top of the screen would say has nothing. Nothing to steal or he doesn't have anything. But he says you couldn't steal doesn't it means that he he, he he has something but you couldn't get it. And the the way this works is there's a, a certain chance measured in a percentage where you are able to steal or not from a, a mob or a boss. So, in this case, it might it might be somewhere around five to ten percent chance of you get the that specific item for fight. I could just give up. 
I could just give up now. I would kill him. Pretty sure that I would do one or two attacks and he would be dead. But I really want the item. Now, I'm just curious to see what it is. Now, it's just out of curiosity, but I'm, I've already wasted more than... What? 15... Item? 15 potions? If, if the potions start getting way too low... Then I'll... I'll have no choice, I have to kill him. I cannot be here forever trying to steal him. I had 30 potions, I'm 14 now. Because he's always casting... Big, big magic. And he could not steal it. It's ridiculous. This is like the third trance that I miss. All of my characters were in trance and they... went out of it. But it's a very, very low percentage chance. Very low chance of you getting the item. I just looked it up. Do you want me to tell what the item that boss have? So you can decide if you want it. Tell me. You can tell me. Because it, it's getting ridiculous and... Probably have to... I'll probably have to... To give in and forget about the item. Because I cannot get it. It's, it's simple. I, I'm coming to a point... Yeah, he, he still couldn't steal it. I'm coming into a point where... I'm running out of options. I only have nine potions left. Imagine a potion. Ah, oh, come on, seriously? No, it's not a potion. I'm gonna start hitting with the other guys and keep on... Linen Chorus. Yeah, it's, it's a piece of equipment. He was a fire away. Of dying. That's it, screw it. He was a fire away. Lilan Quaras. Screw it. No chance. I've wasted more than 20 potions. Just to keep me alive while Zidane tried to steal and fail. Nah. I exist only to kill. It's a shame though. Just how many Black Waltzes do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. How do you know? Are you... He said waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? Third waltz. I can see Southgate. She's gonna go for it. Yeah. Such a, such a shame. A, li a linen cuirass. I had some uses for it. Ah, that, that pisses me off a little bit. Did you see that? That I did see. Our enhanced black mages, our black mage enhancements. All defeated. Betrayed us, Steiner did. It is all his fault. Huh? Unstable, the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. Number three is coming back. True, is it? Hooray! But something is wrong. It's broken. Made its magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. We shall depart, depart, shall we? Run away! I got a whole list. If you want, I can tell you beforehand so you can decide if you want them or not. Mm. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. And here's why. I want to try and do it blindly, or, or at least as blind as I can be, thanks to my very bad long-term memory. However, if you get to a chance like this, and if you're still around, I'll ask you. And if you can, if you'd be kind enough, you can tell me. Yeah. 
I want I want to keep it as blind. Yeah. Don't tell me until I ask you to. If 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 you're still around and you, if you can provide me the information, I would be very grateful. But I, I'm gonna ask you just in cases like this, where I waste 20 potions and the dude can still get it. However, I, I, w I was getting into... Uh, I, I was between a rock and a hard place. Because I was running out of potions. And I could try and... Went to the brink of it and try and get it. But after 20 potions... Chance is... The, the the last nine wouldn't wouldn't make any difference. Yeah. But thank you, Nandle, nonetheless. It 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 helped. Do you see Southgate? I I guess I guess the that last fire. But I thought he he had uh he had more energy than he actually had. I was under the impression that he would probably still have like somewhere around 500 to 1k of HP. But he was just a fire away. I was I was gonna have Stainer and VV attack and keep on trying to steal with Zidane. But yeah. He does it hard so I can understand. Yeah, that's the thing. He, he, he was eating me with Tundra. If it was just Thunder and Blizzard, I wouldn't mind and I would probably hang in there a little bit more. But the Tundra was dealing more than 150 to all of them. So no. Yeah, I had no chance. I had no choice, actually. Had to make a choice. It wasn't a great one, but well. Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but maneuvering through it would be tricky. Do you want me to do it, Tiger? I want to do it on my own. All right. We don't have clearance. They might close the gate on us. It should be okay, though. Security was totally lax when I come through here on the theater ship. It'll be fine, Captain Dagger. Roger. It's old, but the engine's got power. We must turn back. Princess, please turn the ship around. The Black Waltz is heading straight toward us on an airship. He might crash into us. Dagger, Rusty's right. It's headed straight for us. Punch it. Go through South Gate. Don't be ridiculous. What if the gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him in this cargo ship. Yeah. We'll slide him before the gate closes and shut him out. That's our only chance. Rusty, turn the power up to the max with that lever over there. Dagger, stay on course no matter what. Okay. I know we can make it. This dude gambles a lot. At the speed that the door was closing and the distance they had, there's no way they would be able to pass through. This videos look so good. I I'm gonna say this every single time I see a, a, an FMV. Every time I see cutscene, it's I I'm gonna say this. The videos look so pretty. They look so damn pretty. And this is something to keep in mind though. The 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 pictures were clearly cleaned up and made to, to be at 30 FPS. Through the mod and the remaster. But remember, this was a PS1 game. This was a PS1 game. So good. This is how a game should age. I'm playing this game 23 years later. This is how a game should age. So damn pretty. I remember back then. Right, Roro? I remember back then when I first saw this, these images, I was like, oh, they're lifelike. <laughs> But I remember being so impressed, so impressed. For a very long time, Square, by the time, just Squaresoft, 
what for me was the same as ba uh, beautiful pictures. I'm I'm 36 years old. When this game came out, I was 99, so I was 13, 14 years old, somewhere around that time. 13, I think. Uh, and yeah, I was I was very very impressed. I already played played games, you know. I had a Sega Genesis Mega Drive, as we call it here. Played Mortal Kombat, Echo Dolphin, uh, Page Master. Had lots of games. Um, but then I got a PS a PS One because Tekken Three. And yeah, I remember Tekken Three. My brother got Metal Gear Solid. We got Medieval. Which games did I had more? Eventually, we got this one. I don't know. Uh, remember, uh, Realtor will probably be in chat uh, in a little bit. Uh, I might ask him. But Final Fantasy IX was one of the first ones. Not not one of the first ones, actually. I had I had Final Fantasy VIII. I had Final Fantasy VIII. Huh. Memory's fuzzy. But yeah, I remember that. I was very impressed because. This looks so much better than Final Fantasy VIII did. So, why so silent, people? We made it. Come on, cheer up. Southgate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? Don't worry about it. They'll fix it up in no time. You idiot. The cargo ship was wrecked. We lost all the cargo and Southgate was destroyed. I can't believe I played a part in this debacle. Steiner? Yes, Princess? I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words, I'm not worthy. We are not worthy of this music. So pretty. Well, now I've made up my mind. I vow to protect you, Princess, until we return to the castle. How do you feel about that, Dagger? He'll follow you to the end of the world. It's okay, Zidane. Hey, I can see the main gate of Lindblom. That's Lindblom Castle? How gigantic. The city of Lindblom is inside the castle. I guess Dagger and I will go our separate ways once we reach Lindblom. I see. Just when we were beginning to get close. He's only thinking about getting the girl. It's ridiculous. Is he done? Those black mages and I. Are we the same? That's a tough question, dude. I don't understand, Master Vivi. Just what seems to be the problem. I don't know. Master Vivi, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. You're an, you're an individual, no matter what happens, Vivi. Right. Let's go out to the deck, Vivi. You've got to see Lindblom from above. It's the best. Look, the Falcon's Gate is right in front of us. So pretty! <laughs> It just dawned on me. This is ridiculous and it has nothing to do with the pictures. But I, I said uh, uh, a little while ago that I, I that I was saying Bran as if it were uh, German. But now that I think about it, it might have some German influences on he, in this. First, look, look at the look at the scenario. That's that that has something that reminds me of Germany for some reason. The horse there, for example. This horse right here. But you have Bran. You have Adalbert Steiner. Eventually, you will get Anil de Gard. 
those are very German sounding things. I, I might be wrong here, but I think there's a German influence on this. It's very good. Very, very cool. Well, this castle is huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria Castle. Yeah, they don't call it Lindblom Grand Castle for nothing. For nothing. An indoor airship dock. This is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's Red Rose would easily fit in here. Dagger, you don't look too impressed. Have you been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my father passed away. Here comes the welcome committee. Elite car. That's a really old ship. Greetings. I'm Princess Garnet Till Alexandros. Alexandros. This, this sounded Spanish. I humbly request an audience with Regent's seat. Here we go. This is Final Fantasy IX's seat. You must be kidding. No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would ever ride in such a shabby airship. And look at the company you're keeping. How dare you accuse the princess of lying. The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances. Then show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Very well. This pennant. Is it a falcon claw? No. The shape is a little different. Call Minister Artania. If you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, they would not be so suspicious of us. Hey, I'm not the idiot with a loud voice and a dirty, rusty armor. What? You're just proving him right, dude. Shut up. What is going on? Sir, we have unknown visitors who wish to see the regent. And one of them is carrying a pennant that looks like a falcon claw. You are dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. Uncle Artania. It's good to see you, princess. Please follow me. The regent is waiting. I'm 34 years old, so I was 11 years old when this came out, but I never playing it into a few years later, give or take. Okay. 11 years old, it's it's comprehensible. No, guys, uh, just one thing. Let me just check it out here. Yeah, so we're due for... Uh, I'm gonna say one minute ads just so we can have the pre-rolls get away for my from my channel so that people new people that come here don't have to take it so yeah uh, one minute ads I'll still be here and I'll be on chat so yeah one minute don't go away if you're one of the lucky ones that do not get to see the ads well good for you <laughs> I'll, I'm, I'm still here I'm gonna just assure chat that I'm here yeah um, I didn't play it right after it came out But sometime later. Sometime later, too. At months. Not yes. Okay. Two, one, and boom! No more ads. For the next 20 minutes. No more pre rolls, actually. That's what I should say. No, get away. Let's get this back where it should be, and we're good to go. But yes, you know that's that's what I what I just wrote in chat. That's basically my plan. Uh, as soon as Final Fantasy came out, I didn't play it right away. But a couple of months later, I don't even remember when it came out. I know that I actually I might have played it not in '99, but in 2000. Because it was on my birthday that I bought it. That I bought it. So I probably bought it. Ooh. It came out and I bought it next April. Not me, my parents. That's where their gift to me. Yeah. That April was very, very good. Because my brother, uh, my brother's birthday is on the 3rd. 
and he bought Metal Gear Solid 1. My birthday is on the 13th, so 10 days later. And I got Final Fantasy IX. So we had time to play some stuff. It was a very cool month. Um, yeah. Okay. I'm taking the day off. You look a bit tense. Why don't you relax a bit and listen to my story? Come on, you love it. This is uh, your only chance to hear it. Okay, here it goes. When I was 27... <laughs> Can I go a different way? Is there any hidden... Hello. Statue of Sid Fabul I by Laurent, court artisan to commemorate the birth of Sid I. Sid I, I am Nick II. It's good to have a number after the name. It gives you some royalty-like aspect to it. That's why I got a second there. Behind me is the arcade station. What's in here? Ooh, different part of town. Engineer is a bolt. Hey, where can I find the... you know? It's in the main dock, sir. Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> Love the stash, dude. What's up? Dr. Zabolt hardly ever leaves the airship research center. That cargo ship must be carrying something mighty special. So that no so that dude knows. That dude knows what's in there. He's a doctor, probably behind it. For descending passengers only, please do not board. Air cab management. Okay. Descending passengers only. Can I go inside of this? Not yet. I cannot. Cannot ride that thingy there yet. So let's just go on. Welcome to Lindblom. Welcome to Lindblom. Great, great. Love that you guys say the same thing. No. <laughs> Come on. I wasn't able to read. Uh, seriously, again? Come on, come on, come on, come on. The Blessing of Water by Mauricio, court artisan, celebrating 20 years of rule under Sid the Nine. Hmm. Looks like there's no place to insert the medal. The medal. Really? Anything here? Nothing there. This is a restricted area. So, we cannot go there. Hey, girl. You're an airman, right? Seems like a lot of girls are joining the crew these days. Oh, hello. So, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be the airship dogs or something? I passed the fly test for the new model. I was really looking forward to flying number one, but it's gone. But it's gone now. Who knows when they'll finish number two with the regent's current condition? Don't worry, you'll get your chance someday, and you'll be the first pilot ever to fly the new model. By the way, what's your name? Thank you. I feel much better now. Good. I'm Zidane, and you're. My name is Aaron. Hey, that's a really nice name, Aaron. I'm gonna go some. I'm gonna go get something to eat now. Do you wanna? I have to get back now. Goodbye. Yeah, dude. Keep trying. Keep trying. He gets A for effort. He doesn't give up. That's 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 for sure. Glass armlet. Glass armlet. Can I use it? Hmm. Steel gill and antibody. Hmm. 
Yeah. This is clearly... Clearly... For Zidane. Antibody and Steel Heal. But here's the thing, I haven't learned the Beast Killer yet. God damn it, Zidane. I haven't even learned Beast Killer with him. I, I have the Iron Sword here for ages now. Ooh, Bright Eyes and level up. Two of them. And Rusty here, Linen Chorus. Wait! Wait, Zeno. I got the Linen Chorus. It's here. I got it. What didn't I get? If the Linen Caress was the rare drop, I got it. Not gonna question. Not gonna question it. Nope. And cover. There. Oh! Moki! I have a, car, a letter for you. It's a letter from Kumop. Kupo Kupo. Thank you very much, Kupo Kupo. Stillskin visited me, Kupo. He said he found a place that seemed interesting and then he left. I wish he stayed longer, Kupo. Where did he go, anyway? Let me know when you find out, Kupo. Okay. Do you know the French name for Zidane? Zizou? Zinedine? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I love Zidane, if you know. If you know what I mean. Yeah. Still skin, still skin. Kupo Kupo. I wonder if it stopped in Limblum. Silver gloves, maybe, because the stippled hat is the easy one. Silver gloves, silver gloves, silver gloves. Jidan. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Silver gloves. Silver gloves were for Steiner, right? I don't know what they did. Jidan. Why Jidan? Is there is there a joke there that I'm missing? You pronounce the Z, right? Zinedine. It's Zinedine Zidane, right? Do you say G? I I, I honestly don't know. You want me to deliver Netla to Atla? A, a letter to Atla. Okay. Got it. Uh save. I say it like Zidane. Zidane Zidane, it's a And don't quote me on this, but I think it has a a French origin, which uh, Roro can actually testify he's French. Um, yeah, there was a very, very, very good player uh, back in the 90s and the beginnings of in the 010s called Zinedine Zidane from Real Madrid. He's now, now a coach. And yeah, you would say Zidane. Zinedine Zidane. So... I think that's the, the correct pronunciation. But Roro can actually tell it better. But since I'm speaking in, in English here, I'm gonna say Zidane, and because it's easier. And I don't know if it's actually a if there's actually a connection between this name's character and Zidane, because when this game was made, that's when Zidane was actually at the top of his game. Or Starting to this was starting to be made to in 98 99 France had just win the World Cup 
in 98. Zidane would eventually transfer from Juventus to, to Real Madrid. So, yeah, it's about that time, more or less. I don't know if there's a connection, but it's not a very common name. Zidane is not a very common name, at least for... At least for none non French people. I don't know how common it is in France either. So, yeah. This is a restricted area, yeah, okay. So, I I'm guessing there might be either someone in the creation of this game is like a very big football fan or. Oh no. I would say so. Lindblom, Lindblom Castle has three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the arbor and the back gate. Ships hardly arrive at the arbor anymore since travel by air has become so popular. The mist poses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid-level. You can ride the air cab from the mid-level to go town. To go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access to that level is restricted, because the Regent himself resides there. Hey, Dagger, what's Regent Seed like? I lived in Lindblom for a while, but I've never met him. Regent Seed is a very wise. He is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. I wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Are you good in Portugal? I was supposed to go there this summer, but some health concerns, so I'll do it later. But I always told that it was a great country. For... For tourists, it is. For tourists, it is. For Portuguese... Eh... It's... It's... <laughs> manageable. <laughs> to say the least. It's very good for, for foreigners and... and tourists in general because our because our um, the things that we sell here are expensive only for us because our life cost is a little bit down but everything is leveled for for what's below so we have lower wages things are on the upper side of things for us. For you guys, it's probably very cheap. Think, think this, our minimum wage is 700 dollars, 700 euros. That's our minimum wage. If you want a beer here, you can pay one buck, one euro for, for, for a beer. It's one buck for you, Zeno. You can more or less translate uh, euros and for two, to dollars, more or less the same thing. Dollars are a little bit higher than euros, but still, it's more or less it. You want a beer here? One euro. That's it. 700 euros is the minimum wage. Weirdly enough, is also what people are asking to rent a house. A one-room house, for example. 700 euros. It's ridiculous. For us, that's just dumb. One salary to pay a rent, what would you eat after it? You don't have the money. Electricity, gas, water, it's all paid. So yeah, for for Portuguese, Portuguese folk, it's manageable. Hard, hardly manageable, but manage, manageable nevertheless. For tourists, it's actually pretty okay. Because our economy, now more and more, is being actually worked for you guys, not for us. If you want to come here, the prices are awesome for you. For us, not so much. For us, it needed to be a little bit cheaper. Or we should be, uh, should be paid a little bit more. Which we should. 700. Nowadays, without 1,000, it's, it's, it's just done. But, yeah. However, yeah, we have nice weather, the food is awesome, we're quite hospitable, so, yeah. 
Yes, for French people it seems cheap. French? We have lots of French, lots of Germans, lots of uh, English, Americans now, Asians. People love to be here because, let's be honest, it's a pretty country. Because we take care of our things, or we try to at least, when, when there are no interests behind it. Things tend to go wrong, but usually there's some interest behind. If we can make something be paid, we, we will. But uh, yeah, the food, our food is very, very good. We don't, we don't get, that. that's the only thing that we don't get the credit we deserve. Our food is awesome. And I've tasted food from pretty much everywhere. Our food is awesome. Our cuisine is very, very good. We have very, we have tons of influences from everywhere. Even French. Our country was technically born in France. But still, we have lots of influences and our cuisine is awesome. Our weather is cool. It's very moderate. It's not expensive for you guys. It's a very pretty country. You have, uh, you have beaches, lots of them. If you want to go to, to the mountains, you can. We have ice. We have, we have pretty much everything. We could be completely, oh, completely free from imports and exports and be good. We have like this very big, um, sea territory, maritime territory. Is that correct? We can produce pretty much everything. So, but no, we're just badly managed. So, <laughs> our government is not that good. Never was. I heard Japan has some of the best foods in the world too. I, uh, from what I've tasted from Japan, you're not wrong. From what I've tasted from Japan, you're not wrong, definitely not. France, same thing. France, but France cuisine is is known worldwide. It's it's not it's not a no secret for anyone. But yeah. Portugal, you have a very good cuisine. France, you have very good cuisine. Japan, very good cuisine. Yeah, France, France is no secret. France, France food, French food is known worldwide. It's everyone knows that. Yeah, you guys have an amazing cuisine. I would love to go to France. Never went. I only left Portugal to go to Spain. But yeah, okay. So, Sire, Princess Garnet of Alexandria wishes to see you. Where is he? Princess, is something wrong? The regent isn't here, and I don't know who. Take a look at the throne. Sorry. The regent isn't here, and I don't know who. Take a look at the throne. What in the world? Quack, quack. Quack, quack. Greetings. Og. Og. Oglop. Sire. What? Whoa. Dagger, what's wrong? Why are you talking to... Jeez, that's an Oglop. <laughs> Whoa, even the Oglops are being in Lindlum. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? How dare you greet a princess like this? Get that repulsive... Get that repulsive bug out of the throne immediately and call the regent. <laughs> Red, repulsive bug. Please settle down. You are before the regent. Bug is such it's such a cool name. It's such a cool name to, to call someone. It just sounds funny. Bug. What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I remember that moustache. Is that really you, Uncle Sid? Yes. Greetings, all. I am Sid Fabu, Regent of Lindblom. I knew it was you. I recognized your pendant's description. It's so much like my falcon claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly quack, become a fine lady. I, on the other hand... Allow me to explain. About six months ago, someone snuck into the castle and attacked the Regent in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The Regent had been transformed into an oglop and his wife, Lady Ilda, was abducted. My goodness. 
Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled, like me. <laughs> I'll bet it was you. That's not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course, I may be a bug, but I'm still the ruler of Lindblom. <laughs> Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure it can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It is time for lunch. Please follow me. Come on, we were talking about food. Now they're gonna... I ah, know. Okay. Because it's almost one o'clock here and... Yeah, my stomach is starting to... Get ready for food! Okay. We'll have to wait, dude. I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my tastes. See? I tend to have this problem. It's probably the same, the same, the same problem. Yeah, my, my palate is like uh, the palate of a nine-year-old. I like burgers, I like pizza, I like lasagna, and that's it. It's like not, not a very refined palate. I like my french fries with my steak and sauce and yeah. That's it. I hate soup. <laughs> I don't hate soup. I'm picky. I can't stand the food at the castle. It's way too high class for my tastes. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. How can anyone get full on that stuff? <laughs> See? <laughs> my issue, exactly. It's the same thing. The cheap food here is a lot better. See? Perfect. I just found my spirit animal. <laughs> it's Zidane. <laughs> yeah. I, I'm... 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 Same, same issue. I like my ramen noodles. Yeah. If if it can be fried, I will probably like it. And that's that's basically it. I've tried what was it? Um, the caviar. Is it how you say it in English? In Portuguese, it's caviar. I hated it. That that black, fishy thing that it's supposed to be very expensive and very, very high class. I hated it. I was... Caviar, yes. Yeah, I, I, I almost vomited <laughs> right then and there. Yeah. I worked at the theater and they had this... Um, this very... you know, high class event. And after I... I did my shift... I got dressed at my wife and went to the event. They had caviar and I was like, mm -hmm, sure, let's let's try it a little bit with a glass of champagne and let's go for a toast of caviar. Man, <laughs> I put it in my mouth and I was like, I had to force myself to swallow it. Never again. Nope. Nope. Give me a mini quiche. Give me a mini burger. <laughs> I will go for that. Screw caviar. Overrated. That's a euphemism. Overrated. <laughs> it's overrated. It's a euphemism. How can someone hit that? Nope. 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 Sorry. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Not for me. <laughs> I cannot. I cannot. For the life in me, hit that. No. Nope. Take me to a steakhouse. Give me a beef. I will go for that. I don't want. I. I don't want caviar. No. Sorry. <laughs> But that's just me. This, see, this is what I said. I, I have a nine-year-old palate. So, <laughs> it is what it is. The ship food here is a lot better. Today's special is Soup de Silence. Soup du Silence. Cool. Not bad. While you're eating the soup, you're, you're quiet. That's what I'm guessing. Yo, Pops. I'll have the stupid special. <laughs> Who said that? Zidane, I figure it was you. Have you been? All right, I guess. Have a seat. Your soup will be ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Whoa. <laughs> hey. Yeah, do you want a drink? How about you and me go for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Lindblom is quite a sight from high above. 
Hey, monkey tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What the? You've got a tail too, red face. Red face? After I finish my drink, I'm gonna kick your butt. Hey, Zidane, take it outside. Long time, Zidane. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute. You forgot my name? No, I remember. That's Freya. You're Elga, right? Wrong. Christine? No. Nope. Oh, yeah. You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Rachel? Man, you've really gotten big. You nasty little. Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I've never forget a pretty girl's fate name. That's Freya, yeah. Caviar is for the wealthy classes. Personally, I don't see the point of it. Oh, Freya. <laughs> yeah, caviar, caviar is... It's, but that, that's the thing. Do they enjoy eating it? You can be high, a, wealth, a wealthy class, a high class, middle class or low class. It doesn't even matter. Palate is palate. The thing is... I, I don't really think there's there's a, a, a produce or product that's specifically for a, a certain type of people because the the difference between a wealthy class and a lower class is just the, 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 the amount of money in the bank. Because other than that, you're just people. Get the money out of the equation and it's just probably two guys or two girls or whatever. So... Uh, are you going are you going to hit some that, that's what baffles me and if this is true then people can be even dumber than, than I think they are in some cases though because let's face it just because you can buy something that you don't like uh, makes you eat it lots of times just because you can because that's that's what I'm saying here you can keep hitting caviar forever just to show that you can even if you don't like it that's that's that just doesn't make sense at least not for me it's it's a very expensive product sure just because it's expensive and only a, a certain a certain a certain group of people with a certain status usually buys it because it's not that they're the only ones that can it's the only one that they usually do i also prefer peanuts every single time bring me peanuts and a beer and i'll and i'm gonna tell you right now i prefer that to a, a toast with caviar and i don't know a, 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 a glass of champagne bring me an amuse bouche or peanuts I'll go for peanuts. I'll go for peanuts in the football game. Every single time. I don't even care. Yeah? You're from France, right? I would sit gladly watching Paris Saint-Germain against Lille with peanuts and a beer any single day of the week. For sure. Screw the caviar. Again, again this is me and that's my taste. There are people that might like it, that genuinely like it, not because it's expensive, but because they like it, it's their taste. And if that's the case, all right. Now, buying it and eating it just because you can, not because you like it, that doesn't make sense for me. But again, that's just me. This is my take on things, and I'm usually wrong about everything, so <laughs> it is what it is. But yeah, we have good beers. Yes, you do. You guys have good beers. English people have good beers. Actually, UK in general have good beers. Portugal has good beers. Germany has good beers. Belgium has good beers. All uh, Netherlands have good beers. Yeah. Yeah, if you want good beers, be in Europe. Europe in general, we're beer lovers. We have good beers. That's one of the things that I really love about about our country's Belgium. Yes, my favorite beer is a Belgian one, Duval. A Duval is such a good beer. Yeah, but that's one of the good things about being in Europe in general. We had this 
this this thing with with a uh, with beer that everyone seems to like it seems to be like very fan and very passionate about it and yeah you can go to any country in europe and get good beer and now because of the open market and the open borders for products you can get beers from every every single country everywhere so that's just good yeah so how have you been Freya? same old then how long has it been right yeah hell yes about three years hey did you ever find out anything about your boyfriend no so what brings you to Lindlom? The festival of the hunt. What else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh, well, I'm sure you'll find someday. Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. Lazy bomb. Are you ever gonna go back? I have no reason to return to Burmacia. You were saying it uh, a little bit earlier, Roro. Burmacia. As soon as you meet Freya and you get to Burmacia, Say goodbye to your, to your relaxed piece of the, of the, of the game. There is nothing there for me anymore. Yeah, Brumessia, Brumessia is, yeah. I've always liked Freya. Very cool character. So, how is it? So, how is the queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but... Since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised, Guac Guac. They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I fear that she might be planning something terrible. I've brought this matter to everybody's attention, but no one has taken me seriously. They all think I'm distraught after losing father. I understand why you're so eager. I'm happy that you come to me for help. That you came to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother will listen to. When I heard that Lindblom's theater ship was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. Okay. Okay. I once promised your father, Gok, that should nothing, that should anything happen, I would protect you. We've known about the disturbances in Alexandria for some time. But had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Lindblom was behind it. We were forced to take action, because we knew Alexandria would never seek, out, seek you out. Seek our help. Jesus. I'm looking at it and I'm not even reading. I'm relieved we were able to get you here. At the village of Dali, we saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems, controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they were being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war, we won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black mages, she won't make a move as long as we have our airship fleet. Don't worry, Quack Quack. Everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on, don't be so formal. I'm helping you because I'm your Uncle Sid, not because I'm the regent of Lindblom. Thank you so much. What's this place? The heart and soul of Lindblom. Our airship dock. This is dock number one, where we conduct our research, Quack. But, where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. It was our latest creation. It didn't re require mist to fly. The man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no. Actually, I met a lovely lady at the pub. Huh? When Hilda found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into an oglo. Little regent there. He's an idiot. 
He is an idiot. Then she stormed off in the new airship, which I named Ildegard. Pretty ironic, hey? She hasn't been back since. Got I've been working on Ildegard too, but it hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an Oglop. I'm hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you. But with Southgate badly damaged, I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. Don't worry, Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. To the truth. Sorry. English. Uncle, is something wrong? Huh? No, I was just thinking about how the theater ship crashed. Bakushur has good men working under him. Yes. He actually has. Yes. Good morning. You're up early. Lindblom is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go if they want to be alone. Lindblom has always been like this. People come here from all over the world. Some of them come here to become airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Whoa. I don't even remember why I came here my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with my Tantalus brothers. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideout is in the theater district. I'm gonna go there right now. Do you want to come along? Mm, that's okay. I'm gonna go look around town. Okay, then I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay. I can go by myself. Oh, okay. Go find yourself a cute girl, all right? Teach me, Mockster. My first synthesis lesson. Okay. Okay. Hey, bro. What are you gonna teach me today? Lots of neat stuff. Today, I'm gonna talk about the synthesis shop. In addition to regular shops where we can buy and sell items, there are synthesis shops where you can synthesize items to create new items. All you need are two items to serve as the base and a few gil to cover labor. The items you need and the amount of money you pay vary for each synthesized item. Some examples. Yogurt, the desert boots, mage masher, leather hat. Okay. If you haven't been to the synthesis shop yet, go check out the one in Lindblom. Oh, speaking of synthesis, I'll tell you a big secret. Long ago, I heard rumors there's a legendary synthesis who can create the best items. But I don't know where he lives or what he looks like. Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I need to go to the, sh to the synthesis shop because I do have the 99 wrists. Which means that I can get some stuff. There's a letter for Zidane. Really? From Ruby to Zidane. Ain't y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding. I'm opening a little theater in an alley there. An alley here. A bar bar blah. Sorry. A bartender pal of mine is quitting the saloon and getting into showbiz. He asked me to help. Your friend is starting a mini theater? Sounds like fun, Kupo. So, you don't have anything? Okay, let's save. Let's save. How is the pre-rolls? The pre-rolls are back. Uh, guys, let's go for one minute and a half. Uh, one minute and a half. Uh, ads. Make just... That's it. One minute and a half. That's, that's more than enough. I'm gonna save the game. Turn off the fan because I'm getting chill, and get me a get me my water. So one minute and a half. It's all right close to me. I'll still be here. If well, if you're the lucky one that does not get to see it, then you can hear my voice because I'll still keep on talking. <laughs> so guys, one minute and a half. Thank you for your patience and thank you for being here. Yes. Okay. So if you're lucky enough. To keep on seeing me or if you're on YouTube well yeah that 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 happens good <laughs> uh, let me just turn off the fan because I was getting chilly oh, okay. please just 
keep yourselves hydrated. Keep yourselves hydrated. That's that's important. That's very important. If in your country uh, you guys are passing through the same type of heat waves that we have been getting for the past, what, couple of months? Keep yourselves hydrated, keep yourselves uh, in a cool in a cool place and cool, not uh, a very looking a very well a very good looking place, I mean cool as in fresh cool. Uh, and yeah so, it's it's saved it's saved and the the things are done and we're back okay thank you so much for being here guys and thank you so much for your patience uh, the ads are unfortunately uh, something that we have to deal with got no choice I I yeah I will be keeping on warning you. It's gonna be always like this, you know. Like one minute, one minute and a half, here and there. Just to keep the the ads away from new people. Because yeah. It's it's horrible to go to a, to a, a page trying to figure out a streamer, trying to see if he's good. And you get there and yeah, 10 second ad. That's I don't like that. At all. And I hate that Twitch does that. But, well, whatever. So yeah, thank you so, so much for your patience. Patience. That's why I'm doing this. Not because I receive any money out of it. Because it's... If you're a streamer, you know. <laughs> you, you don't receive anything out of it. So yeah. Bobo birds are symbols of good fortune. According to an, Ol an Olgan myth. Yeah, an Olgan myth. The founder of this inn bought the statue. And it has been passed down for generations. Okay. The room was terrible. Also, that thing crying Kupo Kupo kept me up all night. Throw him out ASAP or I'm never coming back, says Lanny. Yeah. Lanny might be right. 163 gil. Awesome. Now, small town night in a big city. What a huge town. I'm completely lost. Poor Steiner. Pardon me. Jeez, you're dressed awful funny. I am Captain Adalbert Steiner of Alexandria, and I humbly request your assistance to get back to the castle. Ha! Ah, that's a new one. Nice try, but I don't date bums. You should really scrape that rust off. It's disgusting. What? Yeah. Huh? Do you always strike out that badly? I think you need a new line. A little shine wouldn't hurt either. What are these things? They're called Gisal Pickles. They're one of Lindlum's delicacies. Do you want to try one? It smells terrible. The worse they smell, the better they taste. I guess I'll try one. Oh my, even the locals don't hit them in one bite. Phew, but you're right, they are good. Huh? Papa's airship fighter is so cool. When I grow up, I'm gonna fly with Papa. Papa should be back soon. I can't wait. Okay. Let's see what's around. Hey, dude. Air cabs are amazing. Back in the old days, we had to walk all the way to the theater district. I don't think I could ever walk that far anymore. I'd probably croak if I did. Yeah, this is the station, right? Vivi's shopping. Whoa, this nut smells really good. I think I'll buy one. Phrasing, dude. This place has a lot of unusual things. Is this food? It looks good. It looks like the sesame buns that grandpa used to make. 
festival of the hunt sale ends today. Whoa, there's gonna be a festival? Hi, I wanna buy this. Oh, are you friends with the Moogles? Are you friends with the Moogles? Huh? That item is called a couponut. Couponuts are Moogles' favorite food. Oh, I didn't know that. I think that's the last one. Go ahead, honey. It's on me. Really? Thank you. Couponut. Mm, what is this? Festival of the Ant like? Well, we let a bunch of animals loose and... Oh, there's gonna be a lot of animals? It sounds like fun. Thank you. She didn't even... And finished. What's so fun about fighting savage beasts? Yeah. <laughs> he didn't hurt anything. Everything. Wait a minute. Did I say animals again? Yeah. Yeah, you did. Good day. Transportation sure has come a long way. When I was young, you used to ride chocobos. They were much slower than these air cabs. It used to take at least an hour to get to the theater district. For the next three days, air cabs will operate on the Festival of the Hunt schedule. Air cab management. Okay. Not gonna go there yet. This year's festival is gonna be awesome. Who do you think is gonna win? I'm putting my money on Ivan. Yeah, he's good, but I heard the female Dragon Knights participating this year. That's fray. I'll bet you two cheeseburgers Ivan's gonna win. Ivan's gonna win. Okay, you're on. I bet you two that it's gonna be either me or Freya. Go away. I'm trying to remember what I have to do. Okay. Rude. I'm the head chef at Lindblom Castle. Castle. I demand the finest ingredients for all my dishes. That's good. Darn, they're not selling at all. Gizal pickles are good, but they smell really bad. Yeah. Now carrying Oglop oil, one of the most popular medicines in the market. Mountain Oglop oil also in stock. Okay. I just came here to watch the festival, but I guess they'll expect some souvenirs. What a bummer. I hate buying gifts. I was thinking of buying some Oglop oil, but it's so disgusting. I trained like crazy for this year's festival. I'm gonna win for sure. Would you like to buy a flower pot? You can use it as a cookware. Cookware, too. I'm carrying a lot of nice pots right now. I imagine that... That grandma has this voice. Ryu, I'm bored. Let's go to another store. Come on. In a minute. Jeez. Man, looking at all this stuff makes me want to become a gladiator. What a cheesy suit of armor. Who would buy this crap? <laughs> Steiner. This couple. This is... Th this could easily be me and my wife back in the day when we were dating in a record store. I would go like, I, I want I want all these records. I want these albums. And then, and this one, and this one, and this one. And I would, and I could st spend hours just to buy one. I could spend hours looking at all of them. And my wife was like, I'm bored, let's get out. Pick one already. Good times. You want to come out on top in the festival. You should definitely buy some weapons here. Yeah. Mithril dagger. Here's the thing, dude. Glass armlet. I already have one. Silver gloves. A deer. Iron helm, leather plate, linen cuirass. Yeah, okay. I have most of these things here. Not a fork, though. However, I'm low on funds. 
but I'm in Lindblom, which means, and I already have the 99 wrists, which means I'm gonna be rich in just a couple of minutes. We serve top grade coffee, 10% of our coffee beans are from the coffee rich heights of Nullrich. Okay. I think you're gonna need some medicine if you're gonna participate in the festival. Uh, you're not wrong. This is ridiculous, but I'm so low on potions, it's ridiculous. There. All the 30 again. We don't have many items in stock today because Southgate is under repair. What? Moogle's favorite food sold out. Yeah, the coconuts. I got the coconut. I think here. Hey, lady. Hey, did you hear? A theater ship blew up and crashed in Alexandria. There's been a lot of commotion in Alexandria lately. Really? A ship, you say? How curious. Who could have done that? The fire's too strong. How many times do I have to tell you? A few degrees can make the difference between a good weapon and a bad one. Use a lower flame. Stop nagging, we've got a customer. When is he gonna get it through his head? The fire is so hot it could probably melt, melt steel instantly. Okay. Silver gloves! Look at that. My dad means well, but he gets on my nerves sometimes. I think the bottom line is he doesn't want me to take over the shop. He has the potential, but he doesn't work hard enough. How's it going? Do you want me to make you something for the festival? Oh, but I need to buy something first. I need this. Cotton, cotton rob. Cotton rope. So, I need a thousand. Is it the cotton rope? It is the cotton rope. I just don't have the money. I need... 1k. Let's get some money. Money. All the money. Hey, Tommy. Hello. How are you? Hello, 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 hello. All the yellows. Not Phoenix Town. Let's... Two elixirs. So we can have two robes and sell two, make some money, and then, yeah. Cotton ropes. I can only make one. Let's sell it. And this is the trick. Doing okay, just starting playing Final Fantasy Night la 5 last night. Excited to play more. Yeah. Yeah, that's so good. That's so good. How's Final Fantasy 9 treating you? Oh man, it's treating me so well. And it gives me 2k. Boom. It's treating me so good. Yeah. That's that's the most the most fun thing that you can that you can do or have um with Final Fantasy is when you start an, a, a a new playthrough or a first playthrough and you get that feeling that anxious and when you have to stop firstly that's you you you, you you'll stop it like I don't want to stop it now, but you have to. But then, you spend lots and lots of time going to... Mm, I want to play more, I want to see how it goes, and... Yeah. If, if you're anything like that... Then, yes. Let's get... Five, six, seven. Let's do it like this. And yeah. Final Fantasy IX is treating me so well. So well. I love this game. I really do. I really do love this game. I really love this game. Now, I'm gonna be doing this a little bit until I'm more or less okay to do it. 
let's sell the rope. Another 2k. Oh, I've got some. I'm probably able to get two now, which means 4k. Okay, now I'm just I'm just making money. That's what I'm doing. Boom. Okay. Let me get some the steeple hats. I have 5. this. Eventually, I'll be making lots of money. It seems, it seems like weird like right now. I can assure you it's not. I can assure you it's not. Can you buy it? Probably can, right? No, you cannot. I always loving, love the combining weapons armor in this. Yeah, the synthesis is awesome. The synthesis is awesome. And there's a very fun way of making lots of money here. Which is combining wrists and stippled hats. Because you can combine... They are very cheap. You can combine them for a thousand, but then they sell for two thousand. So, I'm gonna make 4, 4k now. And yeah. Four K. Now I have four K. And I'll make four and then I'll make eight K. I'm gonna make four of them. And I'll be doubling that. I spent four K, I'm gonna make eight K. And so on and so forth. Boom. How many wrists do I have? 88? So I can technically buy 88 steepled hats. Cannot. Let's go for 20. And I'll have 30 with me. I'll have 30. Okay. Making money. Three. Let's go for the six and then twelve. Six K. After this six K, we're gonna go for twelve K. Because I'm gonna spend all the six K on that. And then I'll be rich. So damn rich. Nope. 12k. Let's go for 24k. Twenty-four K. Now, how many wrists do I have? Sixty-seven. How many steepled hats do I have? Nine. So I need uh, fifty-six. Fifty-six steepled hats. Fifty-six. Then. What? 
67. 65. I need two more. I need two more. Just two. There you go. Now I can just spend every single one of them and make the money. I didn't know all that. Yeah, I got... I've been doing this for a very long time now. It's, it's a, just a way for you to stop worrying about money for the rest of the game. And it's not actually a cheat. These are all mechanics that the game has. So, I don't consider it an exploit either. It's it's not it's not something that you're doing out of you know trying to trying to beat the game on something. It's these are all mechanics that the game already has. If you know them, use them. It's it's a way of making money. You don't need to See, look at that. 16 is already 32k. 32k, which means that next time it's gonna be 64k. That's what I'm gonna make. Money. It's always doubling. As long as you have... As long as you have the, the things... It's money. More money. More money. <laughs> it's here. It's, it's... That's how economy works. 64k. There you go. gonna just spend the rest that I have that's all the ones that are left so 11 which means I'm gonna make I'm gonna make more two more 22 more 22k with the 60 something that I have money more money more money more money more problems too but eh. <laughs> boom okay so I end up with 75k awesome I use this trick as well you mean things like the W item glitch you don't you don't do yeah those those type of things I don't tend to do no that W item glitch I tried it you were actually the one who told me that I tried it it was fun to know that they that exist in a different save I might exploit it but I will say right from the front I'm gonna shit the crap out of this playthrough and if if I'm cheating my way through the game that's a different story in this specific case though I'm not so if I'm not cheating I don't consider this a cheat though this is just economy working you have two items you can combine them for an X price and the game says that if you have that item you can then sell it for a, a different amount of, of money. That's it. That's fair. You have the money, then invest it and then sell. That's investment for you. This is not an exploit at all. And I got to, I got to make almost 76k. I'm done. I don't care about money anymore. So I can just come here. What do you have that I will buy? Got one equipped. A midreal dagger. I don't have one. Iron sword. I already have it. A javelin. A javelin. I'm pretty sure Freya comes with a with one. I'm not gonna use it. Rod. Forks. A uh, fork. I think a character that will appear will have that. So, not gonna do that. Bass armlet. Bronze gloves. I don't have a headgear. Only one character uses it. I think. Probably two characters. Gonna take one. Uh, I have two of those. I have one of those. One's equipped. Only one character uses. So, it's alright. Done. I should probably check what this guy can synergize that might be useful for me, to me. Desert boots. A leather hat and a leather shirt. Sure. Let's get one. The ogre. Two mage mashers. Oh, I sell one. 
dumb. A dagger and a mage masher. Let's try and get those two. Feather hat and steepled hat. Leather wrist. Okay, let's get some more versions of those things. If they are here. I had two mage meshers and I sold one. Dumb. Completely forgot. Okay, but there's one here. Um, another leather wrist, a glass armlet. Let's get all this. Stippled hat. Eh. I need a lot of money because I make 99 garnets on this tree. I also need 99 ore and 99 remedies by that point as well to make 99 gar garnets. Then you need lots of money. But you can also go... Butterfly sword. I need another mage masher. Wrists. Yeah, no. I got that. Leather shirt. Feather hat. Let's make one of these. Make one of those. Two more mage mashers. Yeah, for, for that... For that might be painful. The 99 ore, you can just farm it in the beginning of the game. All the monsters in the beginning give you potions and ore. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Or or is kind of kind of easy to get. Might be more boring than hard. If you know what I mean. Leather shirt. Don't I have a leather shirt? No, I have a leather plate, not a leather shirt. Never, nevertheless, Mage Masher. Ooh, okay. What's that? And a Soul Blade. A Midril Dagger for Bandit. Oh my god, I need all of this. I need Bandit first. I need Bandit first. That's what I do. I grind for ore in the ice cave. Well, I want my Bahamut <laughs> to deal 99-99 damage before Terra. Okay. That's legit. That's totally legit. Let's go for Undead Killer here. Yeah, you need to hang in there. Desert Boots. Fleagil Protect and Scan. Glass buckle, antibody, add status. Oh, I want the add status. Oh, man. Well. <coughs> Screw thunder. Screw thunder. Okay, this this is a... Uh... That kill, add status. That's a definite, definitely, yes. Ooh, but Bandit raises the sex rate to steal. I want that. I don't want this. Oof. I'm not using the Undead Killer. I'm not finding any Undeads right now. I need Bandit. Yeah. Poison and Venom is also fine. You take damage in place of a girl. At status. Yeah. Beast Killer, definitely. The Undead, I don't mind. Uh, equip. Thief's dagger made of midril. Wearing it will make you popular. Elemental defense, water damage redu reduced by 50%. Let's see. Mage measure adds silence. Adds silence, adds darkness. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm cool with this right now. I'm very cool with this. Now, for... Wait. Offering farm fresh milk delivered from Lindblom Plateau. Excellent in stews. A good stew right now would be very welcome. Get your royal family action figures today. Bron figures now in stock. I'm getting sick. The air is so bad here. It smells like I'm in a big oil refinery.
The card game is deep. Oh. Future article regarding rare cards. Rare cards are priceless. The cards you're carrying could become rare cards. Really? Nope. An echo screen. That's good. And an eye potion. Awesome. I'm gonna try and play cards with that dude, but I'm gonna get my ass ended to me. I also steal at least one item from every enemy so Zidane can do 99-99 damage. I also kill 100 dragons so Freya can do 9999 and give the little girl a holy damage boost for holy summon to do 9999. All before Terra, and I do this from the beginning. I plan ahead. That's that's a lot of planning. Well, you probably have already that that already mechanized. You you know from the beginning what to do. That's the same thing with the, the wrists that I just did. I went there, I knew that I needed to get 99 of a certain item, wrists, and I did it. Yeah, that's some planning. That's some planning. I rarely do that. And by rarely, I mean never. I never do that. I just jump first and then look if the, the pool has water or not. But I'm in the air when I notice it. But yeah. Let's play some cards. See, for example, here. Do I know if I can win to this against this guy? Probably not. I'm just gonna do it. It is what it is. So. <laughs> yeah, no. Here. You suck. Ooh, that dude, that dude is harder than me. Harder to, to get than me. I'm gonna get it here just because I want to change it. I want to change that too. And now I'm gonna change you. Asshole. <laughs> Here I was thinking that I was gonna win. Yeah, I'm gonna play rematch. Here I was thinking I was gonna win. I was so happy. I, do. I took my years to plan from watching other people play and testing things out over many playthroughs. I love the game, so I enjoy it. Play this game a lot over the years. Yeah, man. Yeah, you're you're totally on a different level. <laughs> I'm not nearly there. Not even close. Not even close. I don't plan at all. I just go in and have fun. That's it. I should probably plan a little bit better. Now that I'm streaming, that would probably be the the smartest the smartest idea. But I'm not known to be a, a smart dude, so yeah. <laughs> I hit the festival of the hunt. My father gets injured every year. You should probably tell your father that he might not go in on that if he gets perfect. Yeah, if he gets himself injured. This church has been here for a long time. It's been here since before the city was even built, when this entire area was a forest. I don't know why, but this church began the festival of the hunt tradition. Okay. Let's go inside. I can't wait for the festival to start. It's going to be exciting. Originally, the people of Lindblom were hunters. The tradition of the festival began around that time. Okay. Wake up, Grandpa. 
I swear, she sleeps everywhere. Oh, Grandma, sorry. Totally read it wrong. The founder of Lindblom, Seed the First, was the winner of the first festival. See, the first built this church to pass on the tradition of the festival. The festival of the hunt is neither a joke nor a traditional pastime. It is a way of life. It draws on your deepest strength and redefines courage. Be aware. Okay. But isn't the point of it just to hunt mobs? Leather plate. Awesome. We're gonna need to do some grinding, guys. We're gonna need to do some grinding because I'm getting lots of different items. And lots of different... A tent? Awesome. Lots of different items and lots of uh, different abilities with those items. Abilities and skills. Which means... That, yeah, we're gonna need to farm some... Oh, look at that! Is it your father? Hey, Papa, where did you fly today? Just over the border. Really? How was Southgate? It was bad. I think it'll take a while to repair it. Oops. Sorry. Guess how long it takes to walk from here to the exit. 30 minutes. Man, I can't stand these walls. If only I had an airship. This is the Hunter's Gate. You can enter Lindblom by foot here or through the Dragon's Gate. Normally, we keep the Dragon's Gate closed because it's under the mist, where a bunch of monsters lurk. Did you come to Lindblom to shop? There are so many more shops here there than there are in my own town. Whoa, how did they carve stone like this? That guy always acts like such a know-it-all. I don't know why he became a soldier. He should have been an ta a tour guide instead. Oh, come on, don't be like that. I also memorized the Chocobo minigame in Final Fantasy VII and I beat Emerald Weapon and Ruby Weapon and all the final bosses with just Yuffie alone. So yeah. Jesus. With Yuffie, I barely used Yuffie. The games I love to play get extra time in making me overpowered by in-game and or post-game. Yeah. You're you're defining <laughs> the the word overpower. That's that's basically that. That's that's just the definition of overpower. Beating emerald emerald weapon and ruby weapon with Yuffie. I didn't beat them with my main team. That's that's yeah. Let's fly to the theater district. Sure. I need to remind myself what each of the districts are. Yeah, I, I... No, I wasn't even close. I tried the Emerald Weapon and my S was kinked to Kingdom Come. Yeah. Yeah. First time I tried it, that dude murderized my team. Right in the beginning. No. 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 Definitely not. Just so you know, air cabs run non-stop around the clock. Good day. Good day. Air cabs are convenient, but I wish they looked more stylish. It looks so mundane, just like everything else in this town. Ah, oh, come on. This town looks awesome. Business district, theater district, industrial district, and Lindblom Castle. Working to make your travels convenient. Okay. I agree. I beat Ozma in Final Fantasy IX before Ibsen's castle just for fun. I won't be doing that ever again. I <laughs> did just for fun. Yeah. I won't be doing that, I think. We'll see. We'll see what this what this saves brings us. It's it's gonna be it's gonna be fun to figure out what's happening. And I like that. I like a little bit of And that's something that I actually like about my lack of memory. My lack of memory allows me to, to a certain degree, forget things that I've did, that I actually did countless times. I finished this game twice, I watched my brother finished it a third time, and I barely remember the end. The last time I finished this game was two years ago. Not that long. Yeah. Not even, I'm not even kidding. True story. Ask me what happened in the end. I have more or less a clue of the main, the last cutscene of the game. 
I don't remember much else. That's how my memory works. My long-term memory, at least. So, yeah. It's always fun for me to play this. Because I know I like it. I remember most of the things in the beginning, for example. But to a cert uh, uh, after a certain point in the game, I barely remember it. So it's always fun. There's always a, a little bit of... Unknown for me. Eventually I end up... Oh, I remember this scene. But only after I'm there. Because other... If it were the other way around, I would probably get bored. I get bored... Quite fast. Uh, if I'm doing the same thing over and over and over again, if I know it by heart. I get bored. Unless I totally love it. For example, I'm gonna play, and this is something that you probably can expect in this channel somewhere along the line. I'm gonna play every single Dragon Ball game there is, and I know the story by heart. Eventually there's gonna be some Dragon Ball in this channel, in some way or another. I don't know how, I don't know why, but eventually I would want, I, I, I want to kill Freezer again. So, I'm gonna be Goku for a little bit of time, and I'm gonna kill Freezer. So, if there's, if there's something that I really do love, there's something that I really do love, as you can see, I don't mind doing it over and over again. Final Fantasy IX, for example. I know the beginning by heart. I'm gonna do it. There's a little bit of the unknown in the end, so it will make it still interesting for me. But I do understand you. So, yeah. If there's a place in my heart, I'm gonna do it. I probably won't prepare as much as you, but I'm gonna do it anyway. To be fair, in Final Fantasy VII, I did use the double item glitch for 99 Elixir and Mega Elixir. For the rest, it was just grinding a lot. Yeah. Yeah, the 99 Elixir and 99 Mega Elixir work very, very well. That's that's a big that's a big plus. But the grinding, though, that's that's something that I need to take uh, in consideration now that I'm streaming. Because, just because I love grinding, doesn't mean you guys deserve to watch me grind for three hours. And I almost did that with Final Fantasy VIII, with the Cactuars, by the end of it. I was just beating Cactuars senseless because they were giving huge tons of uh, AP. But that's, that's a line that I, need to keep, that I need to keep reminding myself, you're doing it a lot, stop, people are watching. And it's, it, despite the fact that you guys, uh, if you're here, I assume it's because you're, you're liking my stream. And you'd probably enjoy watching the, the, the characters get stronger and things like that. I should also remind myself that I'm providing content. content and Gunt content won't bore the people that is watching. It's as simple as that. So the grinding... I, I, I will probably never I will probably never do as much grinding as I want as I would want so yeah if I were playing alone though different story so the town is big the castle is big why does everything have to be so big why not pardon me can you tell me where I am what you're lost gee you're a soldier for crying out loud this is the bridge that connects the castle and the airship docks. That big building in front of us houses the docks. And big building, big building, again, euphemism. What is that large airship? Amazing, isn't it? It's the Ildagar II. Since it is equipped with a steam engine developed by the regent himself, I can fl it can fly without mist. Impossible. How can it fly without being powered by mist? What cave did you just crawl out of? This is the age of steam power. The source of steam power is water. It's much water than mist. Eh, a bright future awaits us all. Yeah. The card game is really popular right now, especially in the theater district. Almost everyone here plays. Yeah. My wife is a crazy Lowell fan. I tell you, she acts like a child when she talks about him. 
Let's talk with your wife and check it out. I'm just a big fan, that's all. But my husband gets gets so jealous. Tum tum, tum tum. <laughs> Her heart. I like to come here and feed the pigeons. Oh, as soon as I appeared, the pigeons ran away. Awesome. 127 gil. Exactly what I don't need. Money. More money. More money. Okay. The fifth annual Lindblom exhibit this year's winner gets to paint on the church walls. Oh, cool. Or. Great. 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 I'm looking forward to the festival. I'm going to use the festival as the theme for my next painting. You're a painter. Awesome. Can I talk with your cat? I guess not. Mm, pity. I go to streams for the person talking on talking in it. I also will I also will talk way more if the person is a nice person. I go by the term. You're nice to me, I'll be nice to you. Yeah, that's fair. I added this, but if you're you know if you're you know what to me, I'll even just leave or be one right back at them. Yeah, and that's that's totally fair and yeah. One would do that. Of course, the streamer is important. That's, 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 yeah, that's obvious, I think. If the streamer is an asshole, I don't, I don't imagine people would stay there. That's, that's something that I think, I think it's, it's normal, I guess. However, he's providing content, nevertheless. That's, I think, I think a good stream is a mixture between three things. The streamer, which needs to be whatever you're expecting him to be. For example, I don't curse, or I try to avoid to curse as much as I can. But there are a lot of people that like when a streamer curses, and that's fine. I don't. But, and I don't like to hear uh, a lot of people cursing. So I tend to look for streamers who don't curse. So the streamer is important to a degree. And how much he interacts with chat and things like that. I totally agree with that. The the games or the content is providing. So the content is number two. If uh, the game is fun or if it's a game that I like or would like to play or... Even if I don't like to play but I would like to watch, that's important. And three, the overall overall uh, aesthetic of the channel this might not be as, as important as the first two but it's something I try oh no oh my god see this happens my cell phone seriously yeah man I, I know this get away got it wait just a second the, the overall uh, appearance of the channel, and I'm talking about the sound that comes out of the mic, the image that comes out of the camera, and the, the, the overlays and stuff like that. That's... I, I don't... I tend, I tend to forgive a lot more, because <laughs> there's there's a lot of reasons for people to to not have a good camera or a good sound. If you have a microphone, you can have a good sound. That, that that you can do. This, for example, it's not an ideal microphone, but you can do something with it. I'm doing it. And even myself, I'm not optimizing it probably the best way that I can, but I'm doing it the best I know. I'll learn and I'll evolve. And I'll grow. That's what it is. Camera is not a good camera. Eventually, I'll have a better camera. That's also fine. You get to use what you have. It's important and it's important for you to try your best. I'm trying. My camera and my lights together, it, it, they were not, they weren't even 40 euros, 40 bucks. That's it. Eventually, I'll, I'll upgrade them. But I didn't know what I was doing. I wanted to try something and I'm still trying. It's all right. The overlays, I bought them. Plain and simple. I cannot do much, so I bought them. So that's why I tend to be more forgiving about those things. If the, the, the streamer is good, the game is good. I'm good. But I think the the rest is also important. It's it's something to have in consideration. I would say 
I would say... The streamer is 40%. The game is probably another 40%. Probably more. 45, 45, 10. 10 for the general aesthetics, and I'm counting the audio of the streamer. 10% important. Game and streamer, the, the other 90. But, yeah. So, yeah. But that's my take. That's how I, that's how I look at it. I might be wrong, though. I might be wrong. It, it's... In this case, it's not a, a right or wrong thing. It's just a take. It's how you enjoy to to watch your streamers and whatnot. It is what it is. But yeah, the streamer and the way the streamer interacts with the audience and the personality of the streamer, if it agrees with you or not, that's important. And the game, of course. For example, I'm not into shooters. I don't like Fortnite. It will be hard for you to 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 find me on a Fortnite stream. Not my thing. I don't like first-person shooters. That's it. So, there might be... Uh, uh, the perfect streamer for me might be playing Fortnite. I won't be there. I'll wait for him to start playing something that agrees with me. An RPG, for example. I'll be there then. That's it. So, one thing is important. I might find a, a, a streamer that curses a lot, but he's playing my favorite game, Final Fantasy IX. I won't be there. I love the game. But if you're always cursing and... It's not for me anymore. I was like that. I didn't mind. I curse a little bit. Still, I still am a metalhead and still go to concerts and we're all very, very bad and we all have beards and we drink beer and stuff like that, but... <laughs> one thing is not related to another and I just outgrew it. And that, but that's just me, you know? So, yeah. Okay, rambling a lot. Today, completely out of focus. Okay, Zidane, it looks like no one's been here for a while. Yeah, you're right. What to do, what to do. Jeez, it's that late already? I wonder what Dagger's doing. What can I do? So, Princess Dagger. Princess Garnet. A bell's ringing, a performance in the theater district. Must have just ended. Is there anything you need, Your Highness? No, thank you. I'm thinking of going outside and having a look around. I'm sorry, Your Highness, but we cannot grant this request. Right now, there are many people coming to Lindlum for the Festival of the Hunt. Therefore, things are quite chaotic in the town, making security rather difficult. Also, very few people know of your presence here. It's for your own safety, please understand. Oh, guess what? You just became a prisoner. Okay, I understand. Yeah. You just became a prisoner. I still can't stand sitting around like this. I didn't come here to be protected. I just want to help mother. Yeah. There he is. I told you'd be here. Why didn't you tell us that you were back? We're in, we're in Tantalus too, you know. What? Yeah. Uncle Baku said if we find some treasure, we can be in Tantalus too. Yeah, check this out. Whoa, those are Trick Sparrow's wings. That sure is some treasure you found, all right. Yay. I'm gonna try and get some rest, Nick. Nice seeing you enjoy Final Fantasy IX. Thank you so much for being here, Tommy. Enjoy your rest. An amazing rest of a good night to you. Hopefully see you tomorrow, yeah. Goodbye and thank you for being here. Happy. So, did the plan work? Yeah, Princess Garnet is at the castle. Really? Whoa. So, what's she like? Is she cute? Did you ask her out yet? No, I think she's pretty busy. Plus, she's a princess and I'm a, you know, so, I don't know. I bet she misses you. Yeah, you should go see her. 
Good luck. See ya. I wonder if she got to talk to Sid. Maybe I should go see her. But first, loot. 292 gil. Plus 68 gil. Plus 97 gil. These kids, they stole lots of money. I just stole from them. What? A mini Burmesia. That's probably from Sinus. He's the one who likes these dolls. Baku and his crew. Oh. Oh, look at that. There's a chest right there. There's a chest. Better go get it. Ah, true. They were able to eventually get out of the of the forest. Phew, that tasted good. I can't believe we found a way out of Evil Forest before it got petrified. It's all thanks to our bro, who pointed out the river before he took the map to Zidane. What do we need what do we do now, boss? We gotta save our brother. You're right. But first, we'll let the guys outside drink some water from the lake. Sina, bring them over. Hey, about blank. I think it's better that Evil Forest stays petrified. Are you serious? Don't get me wrong. I ain't saying this out of concern for our safety. Then why? I'm sure you wouldn't want to be saved if it meant Evil Forest was gonna be restored too. You're right. We gotta start looking. There's gotta be another way to cure this petrification somehow. We ain't too late. We gotta do what we can. I gotcha, boss. You might might want to try soft. Soft is a good thing. Hey, Sina, what are you doing over there? This spring water might make some good coffee. I'll get the fixings. Do I gotta remind you what happens to members who doesn't listen to their boss? No, please not that. I'll bring everyone over right now. Marcus just stole my chest. Member number 28, she's late. What's Marissa doing? Oh, hell. Stop pushing. Hey, who are you? Who am I? I'm Sir Zidane of Tantalus, the greatest bandit in the world. Have you ever heard of him? No. Go away, stop bothering us. Ouch. Hurry up. Where's Lowell? How much longer do we have to wait? Please, you'll be here in a, min in a minute. Lowell, I love you. Hi, everyone. Kiss me, I love you, Lowell. What's so special about him? I love you guys. That's it. See you all again. Kiss me, kiss me, Lowell. Ouch. Damn, I can't see a thing. Thank you for coming to see Moogle Wannabe 2, Kupu. We don't care about you and your stupid show. We came to see Lowell. Hey, you're... No, I'm not. Oh. That's Lowell. Poor guy. It's tough being popular. I should know. <laughs> yeah. Lowell Bridges, Moogle Wannabe 2 sold out. Yeah. We were supposed to meet here. Where is she? A big Moogle just walked by heading towards the station. It looked kind of dizzy. Yeah. Wonder who that was. That's what happens when people just judge books by their cover. So this was the first one. This was the theater district, right? Theater district. So let's go for the business. Di no, business district is where we came from. We'll probably want to go to the industrial. Business is where we start, I think. That's where the inn is. That's where people do, you know, business. Yeah. So I don't want this. Let's go to the industrial industrial district. 
Peter is where the theater is, business where is where you do business, and the industrial is where the industry is. One would think I know this by heart, but no. Good day. Making those air cabs required a lot of effort. I nearly lost my arm during that construction. Oof. Glad you're safe, bro. Yeah. The regent built this statue when Sid the Seventh passed away. Developed the first mist-powered airship in 1762, led the airship Armada in 1770 71, and brought peace to the continent, died in 1780 in honor of my father, Sid the Ninth. Okay. Hey. Hey, kitty. This is amazing. You can find architecture like this anywhere. This regency is so advanced. I totally agree with you. I totally agree with you. This city looks awesome. Oh, no, putting it in the back is more effective. Wait, putting the engine in the front provides more stability, but less power. To be honest, I answered without hurting the question. Most engineers are weird. Why is that? I don't know. Not an engineer. The store has moved to Falgar Plaza in the business district. Shopkeeper Dragoos. Okay. Sid VIII, who developed the first mist-powered engine, had a pet cat. Since then, a lot of engineers went out to get cats. I have my own too. Her name is Gypsy. Name, bro. Dark Stew, one of our classics. The Doom Pub. <laughs> the Doom Pub. Ah, nothing like a nicey cold root beer after hard day's work. Grandma's been busy selling her pickles lately, and she hasn't given me any attention. Sometimes, I think she loves her pickles more than she loves me. So good that we just found the husband of, of, the, girl, the, of the women selling the pickles in the, in the business district. This is what makes a difference in these type of games. Oh, I'm sorry. We're all out of Dark Stew. What about a game of cards? Watch as I lose lots of cards. Watch me lose lots of cards. Lots of cards. Like this, so... Boom. Great! So good. I'm going to try and beat you. Oh, come on. Oh, seriously. Woo. That that <laughs> That was for this little bit. That that was that could go very very wrong. I got a plan. Play rematch. No. 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 Oh, a bronze vest. Awesome. Huh? What the heck was that? Was in that dish? I don't know. Um, a bronze vest. That has jelly. That has jelly on it. Actually, I can put it right now. That's... 
What's bronze? What's jelly? Prevents petrify and gradual petrify. That's that's awesome. Let's go for that. Guess what? When I grow up, I'm gonna become an airship engineer. I'm gonna build a really big airship so I can go everywhere with all my friends. That's a cool goal, kid. Very cool goal. You know what this is? You're not gonna believe it. It's a steam engine. It's still a prototype. The house gets hot as hell while this baby's running. That's the only problem. I'm getting thin from sweating so much. You're making it work, though. That's cool. Mimic card. Great. No. There's another one here. Steepled hat. No. No. nothing to do here. Let's go to the castle. Let's try and go to the castle. Lindblom Castle. Now, while we're flying, let me just check how we are with the... Yet, so pre-rolls are on. Guys, we're gonna make a um, one-minute break again to run some ads. I'm just gonna be here, stay still, gonna hydrate again, drink some water, and I'm gonna thank you for still being here, and hopefully you're enjoying this as much as I am. So guys, one minute, if you can, please stay there. I'll still be here can find me on chat and yeah one minute don't go away so One really needs to keep on hydrated. Hydration is very, very important, especially with this heat. I know that I keep saying this, and if you're on YouTube watching me, <laughs> every time I'll make a pause, I'll drink water, and I will say this. So it's actually good for you. If you're on YouTube, every time I pause and drink something, you should probably pause and drink something too. So yeah, cool tip. And we're here. We're back. Thank you so much for being here, guys. I really appreciate your patience. Um, we have no choice. It's it's either the pre-rolls or a warning uh, that uh, a little break is going to appear. So, yeah. Thank you so much for your patience. And, I yeah, I really appreciate your being here. If you're here, though, remember, you can... Follow me if you're liking what you're seeing. Please consider leaving a follow or a subscription because I'm already an affiliate. So yeah, if you have Amazon Prime, subscriptions are free. You have uh, you have one subscription that you can give for free. You have so yeah. If you want to drop one here, I highly appreciate it. And yeah, so yeah. With that said, though, boom. Let's go back to FF. Seven, nine, no, nope. FF9. Nine. nine, nine. Yeah. Yeah. Nine. Oh, that works quite well with the German theme. I would love to talk with people that made Final Fantasy. Would really do. Lots of questions that I want to make regarding construction and the thoughts behind them from very specific games. Sorry, unauthorized personnel can use it. Okay, we use the lift. So I need to go up. 
Let's try and see if we can talk with Garnet. Oh, no, wait a second. Who are you? Still sleeping. You'll probably won't allow me restricted area. Yes. Yes. Mm. Yes, yes, yes. Oh! What's up, Steiner? What are you doing here? You! What have you done with the princess? Where is she? Whoa, take it easy, I just got here. The princess is gone, she was supposed to stay in this room. Maybe she went out for a little walk? How can you be so calm? This is a very serious matter. Have you forgotten all the danger she faced just to get here? What if something terrible happens to her? What am I doing here? I must go find her, out of my way. That dude needs to chill. Let's save. Steiner will have a heart attack if he doesn't start chilling a little bit. Should learn with us, guys. He should learn with us. Just chilling, having fun, playing around. Yeah. Games and fun. That's the dream. That is the dream. You're not doing it. You should. I wonder where she went. I could guess. Mm. I remember... Yeah. Oh, this music. This music. Yeah, Zeno, this is the PC version. With Moguri mod. With Moguri mod. Other than this, I've only played the PS1. I didn't even know there was a PS4 version. Is it good? That song, I've heard it somewhere before. That song is so good. Sweet voice. It's Dagger. She's upstairs. Only authorized personnel only can use the lift. Man, I've gotta get past this guy somehow. Maybe if I disguise myself as a guard, he'll let me through. Huh. Not these guys. There's a lonely one right here. Come on. That dude's alone. Hey, wake up! Huh? I just saw a suspicious character wandering around. What? Where? Upstairs, follow me! Says the suspicious character wandering around. No, in here, huh? <laughs> Alright, you bastard, cheer yourself. Hey, what are you doing? That was easy. Get out of my way. Good day, sir. <sighs> Jesus. Mm. I should be able to get on the lift now. Get out of my way. This game is so good. Yeah, Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy VIII Remastered and Final Fantasy IX are on PS4. I thank all. If not, F Final Fantasies are on PS4, starting from seven. Oh. See, now that's an, a good excuse to get Final Fantasy uh, to get a PS4. Does it have? Does the the PS5 has any kind of retro con Sorry, retro compatibility with uh, other consoles? Retro compatibility. That's a weird word to say in English. Not a weird word, but a hard word to say in English. Hey, you, what do you think you're doing? Wake up. How dare you sleep on duty? Phew, that was close. What? A girl? 
Oh yeah, I saw her go upstairs just a while ago. Oh, you you you, you saw her? Okay. This game is such an amazing, amazing soundtrack. It's it's ridiculous. I loved Final Fantasy VI music. I loved Final Fantasy VII's music. I loved Final Fantasy VIII's music. But this one, this this game for me, again personal opinion, is better than the other three combined. Combined. That's how good it is. And I'm counting with One Winged Angel. And trust me, I love One Winged Angel. Easily, prob probably the best, the the best composition of Nobu Ematsu, at least in my opinion. But all of the songs of Final Fantasy IX are just too damn good, too damn good. It's not even a fair competition. Nice song. How did you get up here? This is a restricted area. Come on, I do this for a living. <laughs> oh yeah, you're a member of Tantalus. It must have been easy for you. Yeah, it was. I don't have a PS5, but I do know most of most, if not all, PS4 games will work on PS5. The only games that seem to have some glitches is the Senran Kagura series. No. Oh. Well, it would make sense that PS4 and PS5 games would be the same. They both run on Blu-ray, right? So, yeah. Okay. Thank you. But how about uh, games that worked on a, a disc, a CD, or that worked as a DVD? That's my, my question. Does it run PS1, PS3, and PS3, PS1, 2, and 3 games? Does it have that kind of retro comp compatibility? Or it's just Blu-ray and that's it? You, what have you? Hey, there's a telescope. Let's go check it out. Come on. What a view, indeed. Oh. Oh, so good. Maybe I should check it out sometime. Marshland. Harb's Mountains. Those are the mountains that surround Burmacia. I guess the best way to get there is through the cavern at the base. Oh, yes. I'm gonna check it out. Southgate. Oh, there's the Southgate. I wonder if, if, if they've started repairing it. Nope. Nope. Screw the dogs. Sorry. Sorry, camera. Sorry. Sorry. It's not gonna happen again. It'll probably take a while to fix everything. Alexandria is beyond those mountains. I bet they're looking for us. Haha. <laughs> hey, there's a chocobo. So there's a choco forest. Maybe I can catch a chocobo in that forest. Yes, maybe you can. Did I got everything? Ah. Seabell River. The river flows right by the south gate. You can get to the river by walking along the river. Let me see. How's the view? No, sadly, it only works with PS4 and PS5 games. Maybe someday they might update it so the PS3 games will work or, or even PS2 and PS1. The only consoles that are all before consoles is the Xbox consoles. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's cool to know. Thank you, Zeno. Thank you so much. No clue about that. It's such a shame. I, I, I have the feeling that... I don't know. It's it's such a. I don't know how 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 hard it is to implement it on a console or not, but I have the feeling that it would be so much better for a, a company if 
the newer version would be able to run all the other ones. Of course, they they run on CDs and DVDs, so I don't know how easy would that be to actually have the 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 hardware to run all of that. But I don't know. For me, it just makes sense. So if Xbox is doing that, well, that's a very big point to Xbox. I think I think PS PS Five the the Sony specifically would be would win much more if you could have for example every single final fantasy game that came out for sony or ps playstation to be to run on ps5 now you want to play final fantasy 8 the the ps8 version the ps1 version sure you want to play final fantasy 13 sure want to play final fantasy 15 sure you want to play final fantasy 16 as soon as it comes out sure that's it the happier the customer, the more money your company will make. I, I, this is this looks like such an easy premise that sometimes I wonder if companies think about it at all. If you do your best, the customer will reward you. I think I think this is an easy an easy sentence to an easy an easy concept to grasp, but most companies, it's it's such a shame though don't get that well but and now i'm not talking about sony specifically i've never had any complaints about sony one thing just led to another now this this that i said wasn't actually in any way uh meant towards sony it's meant towards ea for example electronic arts i've always loved ea but now hmm. I'm having some issues with them. Or Blizzard. Such a shame. Okay, I've made so much trouble for everyone. Uncle Sid knew everything. That's why he asked Tantalus to get me out of Alexandria. No matter how hard I try, I always, I'm always a step behind in everything. I'm so helpless. What's wrong? Zidane. Why did you help me come here to Lindlum? Is it because your boss ordered you to? I just wanted to help you, that's all. The boss didn't agree with me. So I ended up leaving the band. Really? I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. If it isn't it isn't the first time I've felt I've left. <laughs> Zidane, yeah? Oh, um how were you planning planning to abduct me? We were gonna put you to sleep with sleeping weed, then kidnap you. It's mostly used for kids, but a big dose can knock out an adult just as easily. I guess you didn't need it, since I came along on my own. Hey, would you mind giving me some? I've had a hard time sleeping lately. Mm, I don't think that's a good idea. You might get addicted. Maybe all you need is some company, eh? Oh, please. You think I'm that naive? Ah, can't blame me for, can't blame me for trying. No, you can't. Um, th that song. Were you singing it in the village of Dali? Yes, so you were up that night. What is that song, anyway? I don't know. I can't even remember where I learned it. I sing it whenever I feel sad or lonely. For some reason, it comforts me and reminds me that I'm not alone. I guess it's a mystical song. Let me hear it again. Ugh. Mm. I never expected... I, I, I'll answer you in a second, Zeno. I never expected to find such fine armor in a place like this. Yes, I'll buy that one too. <laughs> the the armor that that Zidane was here and said, "Oh, that's ugly. It's completely dusty and rusty." This one, ooh, amazing. <laughs> Who knows when that brand will start another war? What? The queen would never start a war. You dare speak ill of the queen? Who the hell are you? I'm a an armor collector. Oh, well, in that case, can you recommend some good armor? I I must go. Go, Knights of Pluto. Yeah. What are those things? They look so stupid. I'm gonna take Sid's airship and destroy them. Hey, cut it out. You broke my knight. I'm gonna go tell your mom. No, come on. These scenes are so wholesome. Royal action figures. 
those black mages were like toys being controlled by someone. The sky looks ominous. Something's about to happen. Sir Fratley, where are you? I need you. Yeah. I'm I'm having lots of goosebumps just for a scene that's it's just it's it's the song, it's the characters, what they're doing, what they're seeing. This this game is so wholesome. I said that I I, I was expecting my mind to change about what my favorite Final Fantasy game would be by the end of all this run. But I can tell you right now. I loved 6, 7 and 8. I'm loving 9 even more. I'm sorry. I don't think it's gonna change. Okay, Zeno. If you did do a cheated save playthrough of a game, would you rather have 99 of every item and equipment or rather have max money one or the other? Not saying you would do it, but if you did decide to do one, what cheat would you use? This is just for fun. Huh. I would go for max money. Because with max money, I could buy all the items. <laughs> there, there's always something. There's always, there's always an asshole who would say that. If you find a genius in a lamp, what wish would you make? And the genius would say, I would have infinite wishes. So, yeah, there's always someone who breaks it. But I would go for the money. Because having... And, and I'm going to give you a Final Fantasy ex example. I put it in a Final Fantasy terms. Having 99 elixirs and 99 mega elixirs is a big, a big uh, boost. It's a big boost, but with max money, no equip, no piece of equipment and no piece of uh, weaponry would be unavailable to you. That's my take. I would prefer that. And the money would also allow you to to get items and be better prepared. So, yeah, I'd rather have the money as well, yeah. I think that's the, the, the smartest choice. That if, if, I, if I ever do cheated saves, and I might, somewhere in the future, I'm doing this playthrough right now, but I don't know, in some years, if we ever decide to get back on Final Fantasy for some reason or another, I'll probably do a very different run. So, yeah. That's why I'm putting dates on it. My, if you go to YouTube, to my page, uh, I'm right now. I think I took it out. I, I think I just Final Fantasy VIII became instead of 22, 2022 became complete. But yeah, I'm I'm I put dates so I can remember when I did it. But yeah, okay, it should work now. Sire, it's no good. What? Ah, no problem, come on, that's fun. That's just fun. Those type of questions I, I always like. It's it's a good way to think about it, and... Because most of the times I just wing it, you know? And, I don't know, faced... When faced with with uh, an option, what would you do in a case like that? That's fine. Thank you for the question. We can stabilize the engine system. It can run for more than 10 minutes. Darn it. Yeah, that's an issue. My mind hasn't been the same since I became an Oglop. Hey, Dagger. So, when do you want to go on the airship cruise? What are you talking about? What am I thinking? I asked the girl at the... Never mind. Well, it sounds like you've asked the wrong girl. Ooh. Yeah. She gotcha. She just gotcha. Wait, I, I can explain. Why bother? Go have a wonderful time. Oh, man. That's an issue. When you ask every single girl out, that happens. Okay, how about this? If I get first place in tomorrow's hunting festival, you and me will go out on a date. How does that have anything to do with me? Come on, please. Fine. Okay, it's a date. Seems like I have to win. It may be tradition, but this is a dreadful festival. 
Mike, right? He might not. The dude, the dude, the dude can can talk his way out of of stuff like that. So, but yeah, it's when when you ask all the girls in town, when you ask them out, something like that is bound to happen sometime. It may be a tradition, but this is a dreadful festival. So many lives lost every year, especially because of him. Hardly, the festival is a test of manhood. I tingle with excitement every year. Okay. This is the last carriage. All the preparations for the festival of the hunt are complete. Very good. Now we wait for the signal. Yes, sir. Whoa. Yes. The fangs have been freed. What? We haven't been received the minister's authorization. We believe that they're going to release him any minute. All right, release the mus before they let him loose. Hurry. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, beasts... The beasts have been unleashed. All is ready. All right, stand by. This year's specimen is perfect. Nothing can stop him. Ah, what power. Oof. Hey, make him stop. It's too early to let him lose. How? I have no control over him. Damn it. Open the gate at once. The gate's gonna fall apart. Go, Zagnol. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna make a small change. Where's Zidane? Please, princess, you might actually enjoy it. Okay. I wonder if Zidane has improved his skills. Hey, guys. Sorry, I'm late. All right, let's begin. Hunters, on your mark. Ferocious beasts swarm about a castle town. The bigger the catch, the higher the score. The time limit is 12 minutes. Use hair caps to go to other districts. Once you lose in a battle, you will be forced to retire. The winner will be crowned Master Hunter and receive the Hunter's Reward. Who will come out on top? What do you wish for your Hunter's Reward? I'll go with Gil all the way. I'll take an add-on. And you, Mr. Vivi? What? I never signed up. I thought you would do pretty well, so I signed you up. Don't worry, with your black magic, it'll be a piece of cake. I, I don't know. That was very inconsiderate of you, Zidane. Yeah, a little bit. Just let me... Yeah. Oh. How about this? If you win, I'll fix you up for a date with Dagger. <laughs> me and the princess? Shh, keep it down. What was that? You just mentioned the princess. What evil deeds are you plotting now? It's nothing, right, Vivi? Uh, yeah. So, what would you like for your reward? Oh, I'll take a card. So, this is actually uh, a thing for us. Do I want Gil? No. I don't want Gil. I have more than enough Gil. I don't want a card. So, technically... Freya should win, because I want the add-on. It's a piece of equipment or weaponry, I don't remember. The add-on would be the smartest choice. If we were smart, which we are not, so I'm gonna do everything I can to win. We might not win. Wait, my camera is... going crazy again. My camera is going crazy again. Do I need to restart again? Stabilized. Awesome. Uh, so, the smartest choice would be uh, Freya to get the add-on. I'm gonna do everything I can to win. Why? Because I want to date with Dagger. <laughs> That's it. That's the only reason. <laughs> okay, Gil, an add-on and a card. The festival will begin shortly and you'll have different, different starting points. Hunter Zidane will start in the theater district. Hunter Freya will start in the industrial, di ah, industrial di district, and Hunter Vivi will start in the business district. Okay. Now, uh, because I really want to win, I'm gonna put the ogre up. Uh, wait. Tell me I have the beast killer. I have the beast killer. Jelly. Let's get the undead killer too. 
What do the other ones give me? I took it out, but... Bandit. Bandit. Bandit, yeah. Bandit is a good, is a good one. But for now, I want the status. I want the strength up, the damage up, so that I can punch them in the face. Harder. I want one hit kill. I want one hit kills. Definitely. Why, why did I... Dude. Seriously. The cap bound for the theater district is now departing. Let's go. Okay. Now, there's there's certain type of the uh, each of the beasts will give us different uh, amounts of of points. So I should go for specific types of beasts. Now, I don't remember which type of beast. So this is how my memory works. I know part of the mechanic, but I don't know the specifics. So eventually I want to kill the big dude. But until then, I need to kill smaller ones. But I want certain smaller ones instead of the other smaller ones, so yeah. Oh hush, go get a, a great view here. You're right, I can see the entire town. Princess, look, Master Vivi is also participating. I can't believe it, he seemed reluctant earlier. Master Vivi, the princess and I are rooting for you. Come on, Vivi. You can do it. No, Master Vivi. Look out. Oh gosh, I can't watch it anymore. You can't win just by running. A good offense is the best defense. Attack! You can't lose to that monkey Zidane. Yes, that's it. Now's your chance. One more time. Vivi, behind you! Yes, go! Okay. I just got in. My time to shine. Let's go. Run. Out of the way. Okay, let's see how much do these guys... How many points do these guys give us? Come on, see that. Oh, the ATB. Oh, the ATB. That, that takes long time. Let's go. Boom! Twelve points. I don't remember if twelve is a good number or a bad number. 12 is something. You, birdie. Birdie. 12. Let's see how much do these guys give. I don't remember. So I need to test it. That's the thing. Oof. While the ATB gets there, there's time for me to go and have a coffee. Oof. 400. So, the other dudes give me 12. Ooh, this one gives me one? No. No, I don't care about you. I'm gonna go for the little ones. I'm gonna go for the little ones. Hey! Can you break that? Are you gonna break that? Okay. How much do you give? So, I have 13. How much do these guys give us? Ooh, 500, Jesus. Thirty-four. So those guys give twenty-one. That's how much. Those are the ones that we should be aiming for. Come on. Those are the ones we should be aiming for. I don't think there's anyone else here other than the bird. I don't care about the bird. Let's go to the business district. Business district. Freya leads with 45. Oof. 
Freya does know what she's doing. Freya knows what she's doing. Come on, seriously. Uh, no! I wanted that. I don't want you. You're just wasting my time. You're wasting my time. You're wasting my time, I don't like you. Trick Sparrow, 14 points. Oh, so that's Sparrow? It's not like the other one. Okay. Yes, you. You give 12 points. You're actually all right. You give 12 points. This takes so long to get there. You hit me with your tail? How dare you, sir? How dare? Ganero leads to 72 points? Jesus. Those are lots of points. Oh. Um, I don't care about you. Forget it. It's time to be shopping. Okay, so I cannot go there. Eventually, I want to come here. Eventually, I'll want to come here. Yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. You're fine. You're a fine dude to kill now. Boom. Goodbye. I'm gonna go for the bird too. Screw it. Bird's here. Bird is here. I'm gonna go for it. Hopefully is one of the ones that give me much damage, much points. Not the ones that... Oh, do not. So. She was right here. Easy to kill. Fine. Six points. Vivi leads with 93. I have 90. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Oh, come on, dude. Seriously? You're gonna be this rude? Ooh. No, 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 no. Yeah, you're supposed to be mine. You're supposed to be mine. Please tell me there's something in this street again. Ooh, Vivi leads with 113. No. No, I'm falling behind. I'm so far away. I'm so far away from this stuff. What's behind? What's below here? I need to go to the industrial district. Let's go to the industrial. Come on, seriously. Every single time. Uh, the industrial district. If Vivi wins, I'll get a card. I don't want a card. I, don't, I really do not want a card. I think it's time for me to go find the, the big dude. It's time for me to go find the big dude. I just don't know where he is. I don't remember. Here. Don't go away. Izinu, if you know where the big dude is, please tell me. I want to go find it and kill it right now. The big dude to kill right now. I don't know where he is. I quite remember. 
Freya leads with 138. Here though, pretty sure. I don't care about these guys anymore. I just want to go find the dudes. I think he's in the is in there on the the theater district down there or on the business district, and that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, go to the theater. She's ahead for one by one point. Ooh, now she's ahead by a lot. Not a lot, I mean. Six points. Six points. I could I can I can still win this. I just need to go to the right place. Which means that I just need to find the big dude. Which I don't know where he is. I don't know where he is. He's not here. Come on. Let's go to the business district. I don't remember. It's locked. It's not here, it's here. I don't remember. The time is running out. Ah, come on. Business. The time is running out. Ah. Well, if Freya wins, it's, it's better. She wins. At least I get something great. But it's such a shame, though. Frey, 151. Yeah, that's... Game, set, and match. Where is the big dude? Right there. Zidane, help. Turn around. Let's go. Damn, you're ugly. Allow me to help. I don't want your help. I do not want your help. Okay, but I get to finish him. I've got a date with Dagger on the line. You're ridiculous. Fine, as you wish. I get to finish. Sorry. Sorry, Freya. Love your face. But my finish. Boom. Boom! 50 in your face! Sorry, Freya! Boom! Oh my god, she's gonna kill it! Eh, she might not. Electrocute! Boom! then did the most damage 79 points boom 79 points see then leads with 216 yeah now it is game set and match got it <laughs> now we just need to just wander around a little bit. Go for a cup of coffee. Let's see if I can go and kill anyone again, seriously. I can go and kill something else, maybe in the theater district. I think I remember there's still a a birdie bird there. 216 points. That's what you get. And you're trying to get serious. I don't want to gill. I really do not want to gill. There's a bird here. Three, two, one. 
Let me kill this bird. Ah. Uh, the time is up. The time is up. The winner is Zidane. Boom. GG, Roro. GG. Yeah. That was marvelous. All of you. 260 points. 16 points. Congratulations. Yeah. We grant you the Master Hunter and your reward. Oh, thank you, my liege. 5k! Congratulations, Zidane. Thanks. Regent? Ooh, a Brumatian soldier. soldier. Oof. Please forgive my intrusion. I bring urgent news from our king. The king of Brumatia? Sire, you must, not let, you must not let him see you like this. Take a good look at him. An injury was as blinded him. Continue. Our kingdom is being attacked by some unknown force. We are severally outmatched. Please send reinforcements immediately. The enemy looks like an army of mages wearing steeple-crowned hats. The king and I are old friends. We will send reinforcements to Bermessia immediately. Thank you, Regent. The king... And all of Bermessia will be most grateful. I must return now. Ugh. Take him to the infirmary. It's too late. He's gone. Ugh. Damn. It's a miracle he even made it this far. I can't believe this is happening. This is a problem. Because of the festival, there are hardly any men left in the castle. It will take time to mobilize. We have no choice. Call back the 4th Aerial Division patrolling the border. But if we recall the 4th, we will lose our eyes over Alexandria. Quack quack, Bermessia is our ally. We must help them. Steeple-crowned hats, they might be black mages, like Vivi. It can't be. Could it be Mother? I must go now. I cannot sit and wait for the, for the reinforcements. I'm coming with you. No, this doesn't concern you. What's this? I'm a stranger all of a sudden? I'm not gonna sit back and watch your home get destroyed, alright? Thank you, Zidane. Um, can I come too? I wanna find out who they really are. Sure. Alright then, let's go to Bermessia. Princess, this is a foreign matter. It has nothing to do with us. Stainer is right. We don't know if Alexandria is involved. But if black mages are involved, Zidane, you know what I'm talking about. If mother is behind this, I'll make her stop. I promise. I think, it should, I think you should stay here. What? We don't know what to expect there. I've already faced great danger coming here. What's the difference? Dagger, this is war. A lot of people are gonna die. I know that. What did you feel when you saw that Bermessian soldier die just now? I felt sad, of course. Just sad? Weren't you scared too? Obviously, you haven't realized how dangerous it's gonna be. You could get killed. This is no time to be talking about convincing your mother of anything. But now's not the time to argue. He's right. We must head to Bermessia at once. Will you open the Dragon's Gate? Of course. If you're going by foot, leaving from that gate is the best way. Let us eat while we quack, wait for the gate to open. Here's a trick in getting Freya to win 100% of the time. In your first fight, kill yourself and then Freya will win every time you do it this way. <laughs> awesome. I didn't know that. Okay. That's good. By the way, can you tell me uh, what does she win? When she's the one to win, what's the item that she gets? It's just to know what, what I missed. The Festival of the Hunt Feast is one of the oldest traditions. It began all over five centuries ago. It is customary to eat everything with your hands, so go on before it gets cold. My favorite type of food. The one where you can just be an animal. <laughs> it's just... You just go in. It is customary to eat everything with your hands, so go on before it gets cold. Okay. Thank you, Uncle. Mm, it's so good. Let's just eat. We can do anything until the gate opens. You're right. Hey, not bad. 
Well, they're all eating. Except her. She is not eating. This is wonderful. Princess, how is everything? Why aren't you eating? Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. Everything is so delicious. Indeed it is. Especially this beef. It is superb. Okay. Oh, I did it before. She wins the coral ring. It absorbs lightning attack, but I can't remember what abilities are on it. Oh, but it's a coral ring. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I, I don't... I don't miss much. Apparently. Okay. Oh, I'm so full. I'm getting sleepy now. Oglop just went down. So did Freya. What the... Food is poisoned by Zidane, by Vivi, and by Stainer. How could I be so careless? I'm starting to feel sick. Forgive me, princess. I should have tasted it for poison. That's impossible. There shouldn't be any in your dish. What? Now that you mention it, I feel just fine. How did you know? Princess, you didn't. It's not poison. It's just a medicinal herb Zidane gave me. Believe me, this was not what I had planned. Stainer, I have to make my own decisions. I had no choice. Uncle Sid would never let me leave the castle. That is because he is concerned about you. I understand, but... No, you don't understand. War is a terrible thing. You must never experience it as I have. I'm sorry, Princess. I cannot follow any orders that might put your life in danger. What if Alexandria is behind the attack in Vermessia? It could lead to war between the three great nations. Many innocent people will die. As the Princess of Alexandria, there must be something I can do. I have to help mother. I don't want to see anything happen to her. Very well. Princess, I will follow you wherever you choose. Thank you. Let us go before everyone wakes up. I'm sorry, Zidane. Come on. Cold. You're as cold as ice. Yep, dagger. Where are you going? It must have been some sort of sleeping medicine. It was sleeping weed. We've been had. Yeah. I gave her some medic some because she said she was having problems sleeping. I'm impressed. There's more to her than meets the eye. Damn, what the heck is she thinking? Maybe she's heading to Bermessia. Then you might still be able to catch up with her. Vivi, wake up. We're going to Bermessia. Let's head for the Giza Malukes. Giza Maluke. Giza Maluks. Grodo. Giza Maluks. Not Giza. Okay. Giza Maluks. Grodo. Okay. Once we pass through the Grotto, we'll be in Bermessia. You can leave from the Dragon's Gate located at the base level. Quack. Let's also find out... You can leave from the dragons. Okay. Don't you have anything for us? Seriously? Wait, wait, wait. Crafted by Fabrizio, court blacksmith. Favorite shield of Sid the fifth. Favorite armor of Sid the sixth. Crafted by Gabriel, court blacksmith. Favorite bow of Seed the Seventh. Crafted by Andrea, court boyer. Boyer? Boyer? Is that how you say it? Nothing here. Not a single item. You are not permitted to enter the royal chamber. Yeah. And blame me for trying, though. Let's go. Base level. Base level. Oh, yeah. I remember this. Right to the Serpent's Gate.
Come on. One single item. One. Just to make... Heck, heck. I'm dying to get back in the castle. I think it's a waste of time to watch over this place. Famous last words. Not a single item for us to get. I heard the arbor used to be a pretty busy place. Since we have airships running on the mist, I guess we don't need normal ships anymore. Don't say that just yet. Wired card. The arbor is up ahead. It hasn't been used since the mist appeared. It's not a good idea to go out. The mist is bad for you. Worry about yourself. Right to the Dragon's Gate. Let's go. Mugget. I got a letter from Sil Slitskin. Stillskin. Do you know Stillskin, Kupu? From Stillskin to Munt. Munt. I left Lindblom and headed north. I walked through the mist and Gizamaluk to reach Bromesia for the very first time. It's raining, as expected. I'm going to look for shelter now. You went to Bromesia? It might be dangerous there, Kupo. I have a letter from Moki to Atla. Okay. This is Moon, so let's save. No! No, no. There's no reason for me to go there. Like this. This is good. No. You're all gonna travel through the mist? Care to buy anything before you head out? Yeah, I do. Let's see, what do you have? Potions. Let's get ten. Let's get... 10. Let's get 16. Soft. Let's get 20. Let's get 10. And 10. And 8. Okay. If you're going to Bromesi, go through Gizamaluk's Grotto in the Northern Mountains. The best way to get to the Grotto is by following the roots popping out of the ground, which extend all the way to the Grotto. Okay, thanks for the tip. Oof. And now... The most peaceful song... everywhere. Look at this. But then you're followed by this song, which is also good too. We can... we, we, we shouldn't hate. Oh, I need to put ladybugs. What do you have? Eye drops. I should probably take a take a look and see what the equipment Freya has. Let's keep on checking the ladybugs. Put back, couldn't steal anything, so they still have something. Yeah, we're we're a bit under level now, which is all right. Which is all right. We're a bit under level. Still, I drops. Steal first. Couldn't steal anything. So they do have a, a rare drop. They do have a rare drop.
It's a tent. Okay. Okay, so they have tents and... They have tents and eye drops. All right. Tents and eye drops. Okay. That's good to know. Let's get... Uh, Midril Dagger. First. Learn Bandit. And that killer. Beast killer. Jelly. Yeah, he has lots of stuff to learn. BV. Mage Staff. Still not... A glass armlet. With anti-body. Maybe. Yeah, no. Um... Spirit goes down, evade, and magic evasion goes up. Sure, let's teach him this. Freya. Freya has a ja Sorry, as a javelin as I suspected. A rubber helm. But I can give her iron helm so she can have level up and bright eyes. Level up is awesome. Antibody and undead killer. Let's keep her with antibody. She has heavy armor just like... Um, Stainer, so Bird Killer would probably be a better one first. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna give her this Desert Boots. Sure. Uh, the abilities Protect Girls, Flea Gill. I want Bandit now. I want a Bandit. Um, take out the undead killer. Hopefully I won't find any. Undead will... Level up. Bright eyes. Antibody. Hopefully we... Ooh, a dragon killer. But in the same way there that we won't be finding any dragons, I'm pretty sure I won't be finding any undead. We'll adjust accordingly in case we're... Astoundingly wrong. So, yeah, that's how it's gonna be for now. Okay, this map looks awesome, by the way. Just saying. Lindblom's Dragon Gate. Lindblom? The Grotto is here. Gizamaluk's Grotto. Gizamaluk's Grotto. But let's go to the Shoko Forest. Yeah. Let's go to the Shoko Forest first. Oh, look at that. What are you? Please tell me you do not count as dragons. Dragon. Ooh, she doesn't have any yet. Hedgehogs. Hedgehogs, I need to know what you guys have. Oh no, my energy is low. Horse. So... Zidane is down. Zidane is down. I'm... Yeah, I'm... I'm... Kill them. Kill them. Kill them. Ram, oof, why is he then? These guys need to die. And Zida needs to be up. So that he can get some experience too. Attack him, attack him. He's not dead. Oof. Screw it. Bye. You suck. You suck. Oh, 
Well, Vivi is better than the other ones. Phoenix Downs, come on. Uh, let's... Oh, I cannot. I need to... Hold the dude. Hey, little dude. Let's tent. Let's tent. And save since we're here. Actually, since we're saving, I'm pretty sure we're due for a, a little one minute break. Yeah, was right. So let's go for one minute break. Let's add some ra some. Let's run some ads. Hydrate yourselves. If it's hot where you are, so yeah. One minute. I'll be in chat and here. So. Okay. You'll hear. Keep on hydrating. Well, that's one and a half liters away. <clears throat> it's a 20 minute of pre-rolls off, but it's something, I mean. God damn the pre-rolls. I really do not like it. At all. Okay, so... 10 minutes. 10 minutes, 10 seconds. Away. This is about to start in... 3, 2, 1... And we are back. No, no, no. Right here. Right here. So, did I save? I think I did. I hydrated myself. Now, where do we need to go? I'm there. That's a piece of ocean. I need to go to the other side. Nope. Not this side. These guys don't have much to steal. So, instead of playing around... Instead of playing around... Bye. Let's not play around. So, they cast fire. Vivi's gonna cast fire on them, but I'm guessing Blizzard's probably better. Deals 100. There. So, yeah. Instead of trying to steal from them, I'm gonna just... Punch them in the face. It's better to do it like that. What's there? Hello! Oh my god, you can't lock dragons, right? Scorpions, no. Uh, I'm gonna guess... Maybe Blizzard? I really want to see what you guys have. I'm doing the same mistakes over and over again. But I really want to see what do these guys... What these guys have. If we steal from them. Antidotes. It's okay. Oh no. Frey just dealt 200 and the guy's still alive. No. We cannot play around. We cannot play around. Yeah. 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 Attacking stance. Yeah. These guys do not play around and they deal some damage. And I'm down a healer. Yeah, I should I should take that into consideration. I'm down a healer. Dagger's not with me. But they do give some very good experience. 92 experience. That's great. That's great. Oh, awesome. There is nothing here. I mean... 
there's probably nothing there. Anyway, but still, we're gonna go in. Look. I'm gonna concentrate fire. Fire. I'm gonna just concentrate aggro on a on a on a mob. One at a time, because if I take an attack, at least it's only one. When it's their time to attack, I've already killed at least one. Boom! Down. Okay. Um. This is probably a dumb idea. Look at that. Dumb idea. <laughs> We're too low level, so I don't mind. Oh, look at that! Dude! Back attack? No. You're not gonna back attack me. Not in your wildest dreams. Sorry. Not sorry. Goodbye. I'm putting Frey in the back. I wonder. It's only worth it when she's jumping. Or she's using the dragon. Which she is not yet. Yeah. She's not yet. So she probably... I'm gonna put it in the front. Uh, order. So at least she's dealing more damage. Eventually, when she has dragon, the dragon abilities, I'm gonna put her in the back. It's better. Okay, now we're face to face. Whoop. And you're down. Good to know. One seventy six, so much more damage now. Awesome. Good girl, Freya. Look at that. Got it. Who's Marsh? Who's Marsh? Oh, look at that! Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. You want to learn from me too? Yeah, teach me some stuff. Nothing. I got all that. I just need directions. Hey, if you want to go to Bromesia, it's further north. Press select on the world map and use the map to confirm your directions. Remember, you have to go through the Gizmaluk Grotto at the base of the mountain to get to Bromesia. I already know everything. Let's get in. Hello, hungry. Zidane caught a frog. Want a frog? You got a frog. Frog's very good. Queen, uh... Right? Who the heck are you? Me? Queen, 
Vina, do you want this frog? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. All right, here. Yay! Vina received a frog. We're gonna get some frogs. Yeah. Mine, mine. You pathetic, Quina. Can't even feed yourself. Come on. Don't be like that. Can't master art of eating, just chasing frogs, Quina. But, master, frogs very good. Frogs here best, better than Alexandria's. Quina, you in darkness, need some light. World big place, many, many foods. Alexandria just one kingdom, you need to go out more, eat other food. Go out into the world? Sounds scary. Are there yummier frogs outside? Of course, many good frogs. All coos love, all coos love frogs best. Eating frogs is key to growth. Kew marches exist all over the world. Go eat frogs in other marches. I promise you get much learning. Traveler, please show Quina the world. Anywhere with food, good. Why not? Will I find yummer, yummier frogs outside? There is plenty of stuff in this in the world that tastes better than frogs. Really? Really? Okay, I go with you. We got a new friend. And this one is a weird one. What's up, Vivi? Um... That man looks exactly like my grandpa. Your grandfather? Who? The quail guy? Yeah. Quail? Quail? How do you say that? Yeah, maybe he knows my grandpa. I'm gonna go talk to him, Zidane. What's wrong? Something on my face? <laughs> it's definitely something on your face. Mm, do you know a man named Kiwan? I not know that bigot. Jesus Christ. Grandpa Kiwan was a bit strange, but how do you know him? I I know can answer. Grandpa Kiwan looks exactly like you, Mr. Kiwel. Of course, we're from same tribe. You really don't know him? No, I not know this Kiwan. Honestly? That's too bad. Let's go, Vivi. Okay. It's not... Quina, she he still need much learning. Please help him. Okay. Undefined. Got it. Come on. What are we gonna do now, chat? Do you guys know? See then, can I catch frogs? Sure. Just for a little while. Okay, so I need to leave uh, one of them so they can reproduce. I need to leave a female and a male. Ones are with risks, the other ones are without risks. One with a black, a black wrist. So, the ones with the wrists, females. I need to leave one with a, a black wrist, a black line. Those are females. And I need to leave uh, uh, another one without it, because that's a male. 
leaving two helps the the pond repopulate faster. You're working hard, Quina. You come for a long way of Gourmand. I give you this. Or, okay. Thank you, Master QL. I train more. Ah, Jesus. Gotcha. Now, we need eventually 100. Gotcha. A female? Yeah. So there's only one female left. We're, we don't need that female. We're gonna go another after the other ones. Jesus Christ, big jump. Go, the other side. Side games are fun. Yeah. Side games are awesome. They, they actually... They add a lot to a game. They add a lot to a game. You're working hard, Pena. I give you this. Ether. Okay. Thanks. Ah. So close. So I just need another one of the males, and then I'll leave the rest there. I'm gonna get grab one of the males. It could be that one. Gotcha. There. The other two will repopulate the, the pond. It's a male and a female. I done catching. Let's go. The other two will repopulate the the pond faster. If I took all of them there, it would be a very long while until that pond would have more frogs and yeah, it would ruin everything because we do need to catch uh, 100 frogs. So, here's March. Jacobo's forest. We need to go that way. We can. If we can. These games are so rich. Oh, completely forgot to watch Queen. All attack. Everyone attack. Completely forgot to check Queen's uh, equipment and attacks and stuff. Miss. Boom. Quina, what do you have? A fork. That's it. High tide. Since it doesn't really matter, let's give her a sickled hat. Leather wrist. Green thunder. Doesn't matter. Um. High tide. What does it do? Allows you to trance faster. And it's awesome for her. Earth Rans is very, very good. She's basically our Quisties. <laughs> She's this game's version of Quisties or... Yeah. Or... What was, what was the name of that materia that uh, allows us to... to learn... Elemental material. It's it's elemental material. No, the name of the material in Final Fantasy VII that allows us to learn the certain abilities from mobs that we face. Kupu, I'm Mini, master of the forest. This Chocobo is my friend. Kupu, his name is Choco. We. And this is Chocobo's forest. Yes, we're gonna learn and get some stuff here. Hey, did a cute girl with long hair came by here? No, but ugly girl came by here. Oh, I guess she didn't come this way. Maybe she's heading towards Bermassi after all. I'd better get moving. You in a hurry, Kupu? Yeah, sort of. 
Then take Choco. You won't run into monsters if you ride Choco. Choco, come here. It's okay, don't force him. No, if Choco hates, Choco runs away. Choco, come on, Koopo. Whee! Fine, I'll just get to the point, Koopo. These are Gizzle Greens. You can call Choco outside the forest with this. Find Choco footprints near the forest, Koopo. Use Gizzle Greens there and Choco will come. Choco likes you, Koopo. You call and he'll come. Please train Choco. Make him strong. Come back to this forest after you call him in the world. I'll tell you a big secret, Koopo. Receive Gizzle Greens. Eh. Can't do the thing yet. He's all greens. Choco, how are you, Kupo? Whee! Learn how to navigate on Choco. Okay, got it. What's the big secret? Welcome back, Kupo. I knew you'd get along with Choco, Kupo. Did you know Kupo? Once Chocobo chooses its master, it follows him forever. Choco ran away from his last master. That guy was mean. Choco didn't like him, Kupo. I helped Choco escape. Now we're living together, Kupo. Here's the thing, Kupo. Choco has ability to seek out treasures and items hidden underground. But I can't ride Chocobos. Will you help me, Kupo? 60 guild per game, and you keep all the items Choco digs up. Hey. Good call, Kupo. Try now. Okay, let's give it a try. And Digo is the square. Let's you know, choose... Gui means there's something. Gui means it's far away. Gui means there's something. Gui means it's far away. Gui means you're close. Gui means you found something. Rare treasures are buried deep. Once you find something, dig square until depth reaches zero. When you dig with square, Choco lets you know how close you are with treasures when he finds it. Okay. Start. Uh, select. Come on. Seriously? Special bonus, you get additional 5 points. Okay, great. Big level 2. Chocobo's big became stronger. Big level 3. On the soft. Great. Let's go. Eye drops. Another flamingo. Come on, there's another one. Where's the other one? Time's up. Stone with patterns, 25 points. One point. One point. What's good? What's this stone with patterns? Can I see it, Kupo? There's a picture of some location on the stone, Kupo. This place must have tons of treasures. Why don't you go out of the forest and look for this place, Kupo? It's free of charge, of course. Go outside and press Y while, while you're riding the Choco to choose which stone you want to find, Kupo. You can dig with square. Yeah. I've got an idea, Kupo. Let's call this stone Chocograph from now on. Chocograph? I think Choco's been searching for something all his life. There must be tons of treasures, Kupo. You might find some cards, so you should leave some room in your card inventory, Kupo. I want Gizzle Greens. Uh, let's have... 20 of those, sure. I have 37 points. Let's play Chocobo Hot and Cold. Let's play. Okay. If they yield, great.
Come on. Seriously? I must be so close, but it's elusive. There you go. He's all greens. Great. Oh, this one was... This was a very bad one. Ah, very bad one. Where is it? Come on. Where is it? There you go. 50 gil. There you go. Ooh, big one. Chocograph, great. Ooh, another one. Awesome. Find find the ore. Come on. Come on, there's still time. There's still time. Show me the other one. Ah, time's up. I have to go. Thanks for the fun. See you soon. Thank you, Roro. Thank you so much for being here. Have an uh, rest amazing... Uh, uh, have an amazing rest of day. That's what I want to say. Thank you so much. Bonjour. Okay. This was fun. Got to Chocographs. One more. Last one. And then we're gonna get out of here. See you, buddy. Thank you so much for being here. There you go. Neko screen. Ah, very good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, you got <laughs> on the potion. Right. There's one here. I know there's one here. There you go. Ooh, big one. Big one. Chocograph. Big became stronger. Awesome. Total 3 found, 22 points, big level, plus 1. Awesome. Can I see it, Kupo? It's a fragment of Chocograph, Kupo. There's something carved on back. It's faded, Kupo. I'll put it in key under your item map. Take a look, Kupo. I think you're supposed to collect the pieces until you complete one Chocograph, Kupo. Really? That's item. Kupo nut. Kupo, 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 Kupo. Great. Mini Vermessia. It's most coveted piece of the famous tri triptych. You'll never see a rare item. There. Danger in the sky. If you dare to face it, use this wreck to find your way. And Denarius. The story of the 12 zodiacs. The 11 zodiacs pondered. How best to catch Virgo's heart. Arius headed east. And the master hunter. I shall follow in the footsteps of Sid the First, the explorer king. The true hunter must seek this target in the sky. Okay, great. Take a look at the cho chocograph. Ooh, where can I find that? Stream site. Go check where the river meets the ocean. It might be on this continent. This might not. 
So I got to Chocographs. Stream side. Uh, cancel. Let's go. We maybe we can maybe find this one, where the river meets the ocean. First, we need to find the river, then the ocean. Okay, cannot go this side. Open Chocograph menu. Select, not this one, this one. You're hopeless if you can't find this, Kupo. <laughs> Freaking muggle. Muggle. Where the river meets the ocean. Let's see. As soon as we find the river. If there's even a river. I think there is, though. Yeah. Right here. So it's probably on the other side. Somewhere in here. Is it near the water? There you go. On the treasure chest. Chest. Found two elixir, three high potions, four ethers, two Germinus boots. Ooh. Cancel. Uh. Okay. Okay. So we did got some stuff. Chocobo's Forest. This is the Kismarch. Lindblum Dragon's Gate. This is Lindblum. We need to go here. Gizmaluk's Grotto. Probably on this side. Or not. Definitely not on this side. Definitely not. Wait. Yeah, right here. Anything here? Ah, he's March. Okay. Let's uh, take the chance that we're here. First, let me just check next level. Eh, right a ways away. Um... However, I would love some level 10s now. We're gonna go to level 10 first. We have a full team. We're gonna get level 10 before we get into Gizamaluk's Grotto. Yes, we're gonna do that. I think that's the smartest... smartest thing to do. Not... by facing just a dude like this, but... Oop! Goodbye. Just one won't make the cut, but we'll face a couple. We'll fa we'll make some fights here, maybe here in the forest. It's one of the things that I need to take care of, is take a look inside forest because sometimes there's not only mobs that appear in the forests. Sometimes there are some. Dudes that just want ores and they trade a whore to hit for uh, an item. Or there are some dudes with questions that give you stuff if you answer correctly. Oh yeah. Boom. Winner for the win. These dudes, they do give some fine XP. Boom! Present counter. Okay. Eat that dude.
trends. Ooh. The trends right now. And I did that on purpose because now Queen can attack. Can eat. Eat the dude. He's able to mighty guard. Awesome. Critical with 6k. 600. 67. 672, sorry. I in math. I know it. I know how to do math. I really know how to do math. Um. We're gonna get some le some levels. At least one level on each character would be good. And it's fine because Queena still needs to learn some stuff. Just got Mighty Guard. Mighty Guard is awesome. I mean, awesome-ish. I can have her... Gonna beat in there. There. Uh, and eat. You can attack. This dude here. That doesn't kill it. And what doesn't kill it makes it strong. Pumpkin head. Awesome. So, fire on all of them. Ooh, Queen is down. Queen is down. Not good. I think it's fire and Zidane will take care of it. Yeah. Yeah. She did learn Pumpkin Head. She did learn Pumpkin Head. Something. And this is something that I'm doing that is probably wrong. I'm I'm playing this game as if I was playing Final Fantasy VIII or VII. And I need to, to, to understand that or to remind myself that the I the way that I'm using items here it's not the same way that I did in the other ones. Items here are more like are, are more You need to use them more. That's what I'm gonna say. They need to be used more. It's it's a different way of doing stuff. Just attack. Attacking stance. Hopefully that dude dies before doing anything. Boom! Dead. Ooh, Kina deals 22. Yeah. 22 is not a good number. Poison counter. And the staff. Yeah, they deal lots of lots of attacks. That's why they do some damage. 45 here, 45 there, they do a counter and then the attack. So, yeah. There, we got a 10. Vivi levels. Well, after another fight like this one, Quina is at level 9. In, in just a little bit, so yeah. As soon as Zidane is level 10, I'm good to go. Someone learned something. I just don't know who. It's not you. Not you. Probably you. Antibody. Yeah. She learned prob probably the one she learned. Freya learned antibody. Which means I can teach her undead killer. She'll lose some spirit, but. Let's go for Undead Killer. Probably has the space, I think. Pretty sure. Right, it's clean, come on. There you go. Ooh, Dragon Killer. Dragon Killer. Undead. Later. We'll get Undead later. No, no, sorry. No, I didn't mean to say to call you. No. I didn't mean to call you. 
no, I did not. Come on, another fight, let's go. Attack one. VV is running out of... Yeah, VV is out of MP. See, that's what I was talking about. I could use an Eater. It's easier to find Eaters here. It's easier to get the Eaters in this game. They're dealing more damage now. You can actually feel the characters getting stronger. Zidane learned antibody. Great. What teaches antibody? What teaches antibody? But he's, that but he still has to learn. Uh, is not level 10 yet. Vivi is. Awesome. As soon as Zidane is level 10, I'm going. Don't think I need to wait for Kina. Kina. You! You're very rude. You're a very rude dude. Yeah. I need you to... be dead. And Beast Killer. Awesome. All the things. He's learning all the things now. Well, that... Just a second, though. Oh, see, she, she will learn anyway. She will grow to level 9 anyway. She, he, they will, look, they will grow to level 9. Can I eat this dude? One of this and an it. Let's see. Until it's weaker. Big hit. Big hit. Wasn't supposed. It wasn't supposed. She learned. Come on, Zidane. We're all waiting for you. We're all waiting for you, Zidane. One of those little dudes would be great. So she could learn some stuff. You... I already got it. Go Frey. Go Frey. Yeah. Go Frey. There. 320. 118. Okay, 118. I can. That's two fights, more or less. Those two. Those are. That's our. That's two good fights. So this one. Gives me almost 100, I think. If I remember correctly. Back attack. Frey kills it. Or not. Poison counter. Yeah, that's 44 attack. The counter. When when they're in this stance, counter deals some damage. They're always countering. She doesn't has antibody. She doesn't have antibody. They don't have antibody. The other characters they do have. Why aren't the dude dying? It took some time. Died. 
Ooh. Oh no, Vivi's in trance and... Let's give an ether to Vivi. I'm gonna give an ether to Vivi because... He's in trance. Cannot use his attacks. Now you can. Now you can. Gonna pass. Double black magic. Boom. But then... Here comes Freya, dealing 300. Jesus Christ, Freya. Come on. 69. Still not enough. Still 69. Nice. Uh, no, not you. 49 magic. 49, uh... Forty-nine XP for Zidane to learn to to grow. Level. That. Numbers. Math. All of those. I don't think you guys are enough, though. I don't think you guys are enough. Stole? These dudes steal from me? How dare they! Oof, 25 to go, seriously. One, one, we're one away. Okay. Now's, now's the time, chat. Now's the time. Now's the time when these two dudes give me what I need. But that spear deals some damage. And fire. They don't have much resistance now. They die with a one hit, but they actually deal some damage. Okay. It's something, though. And he leveled. Awesome. Now, phrase a level already, almost at level 11, but eh. Uh, let's stand. Save. Yeah. Tent and save. And get ready to get to. Gizama looks Gruto tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow, guys. Today, I'm gonna get out of here. It's four o'clock. And I need to go and have some lunch. Because it's four o'clock in the afternoon and I haven't lunched yet. And I need to. Otherwise, I die. Yeah. <laughs> Who knew you actually need to hit? So, guys. I'm loving this game. I'm loving this game so much. It is my favorite game for a reason. Everything is nostalgic. Everything is pretty. Everything sounds good. And yeah. And you guys have been amazing today. As always, actually. You guys have been the MVP for quite a while now. And yeah. My chat is awesome. The, the community that is is actually growing is 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 amazing it's amazing lots of good vibes to you all lots of love to you and um yeah thank you so much to you too watching later on on twitch or on youtube whenever you are in time wherever you are in the world and yeah i appreciate you too so if you're here if you're liking what you're seeing please leave a follow leave a subscription if you want to help the channel. Remember, subscriptions. Uh, you can, if you have Amazon Prime, you have a free subscription that you can actually give to any streamer that you like. And 
if you want to leave it here, hey, I appreciate it very much. So, yeah, guys, thank you so much again. This game is so good, so good. And, yeah, it's awesome being able to actually play them, play it with you. So, yeah, if you're interested in following uh, me on different social networking systems, media stuff, you can follow every single one of my streams on Nick Holden, at Nick Holden on YouTube. Every single one of my streams goes there the next day after I stream it. So this stream will be back, will be on YouTube tomorrow at Nick Holland. Uh, you can, you can find, um, yesterday's stream in some minutes. As soon as I finish this stream, I will put it public. So yeah, yesterday's stream will be available in a couple of minutes. You can also follow me on Beyond Existence Official if you're into metal, if you want to, if you're interested in reading some articles, some things that I like to say about some bands or albums that I that I enjoy. So, yeah, that's it. So, again, guys, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for your support. It means the world to me. And I'll be back tomorrow, 11 a.m. UK time zone, Portugal time zone, or GMT plus one for more Final Fantasy IX. And, yeah, I can't wait. So, I really, really hope that I can see you all tomorrow again. If not, then I'm sure I'll see you all on the next level. Bye.